Hold on, let me grab this. Did I not get the thumbnail going? Are we good? Are we good? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Bingo. This isn't the right link. Dude, why isn't the thumbnail showing up? I hate streaming on YouTube. There's like the whole point is I want to be able to have thumbnail. I want to have thumbnail. Um, I'm gonna delete this. And post this again. There we go. BBR D League watch through. Bingo. Do things have not gone in the manner in which I have wanted them to go. Hold on, let me ping my server. Stream pod. I haven't streamed in like fucking months. I streamed one BBR regular season watch through, and that was it. That was legit it. Attempt two. Yeah, that's that's my bad. What's up, guys? That's my bad. I uh I don't know. I forgot the thumbnail the first time. The thumbnail wasn't working, and all this fun stuff. All this fun stuff. Um, let me see if I can make this D League or the yeah the D League like bingo look a little bit nicer. Tomorrow, how are you today? I'm doing good. How are you guys doing today? Oh my god, a little bit. So you might not even be able to get through all the games this morning because I have to work later and I have to like you know get ready for work and shit. Um, and I had I forgot I had my pat game this morning, so I couldn't like play super early. Hold on. I would also like to order some food really quick. Or some Chick-fil-A. How are we feeling about Chick-fil-A? Hair sweep. <laughs> I guess that is pretty ironic, I spent. Um never really getting 80s in the gas stream. Hair sweep. The bingo is so good. I, I'm excited. I haven't done a bingo stream in a minute. I only did one for regular season. It wasn't like, you know. What I wanted to. Hold on. I am mad hungry though, so I'm gonna order some food really quick while we wait for people to roll in. Are you thinking one chicken sandwich or two? Two is probably what I'm hungry for. I didn't eat breakfast. I had a cup of coffee. That was it. Um, but that's also expensive. No, we're balling out today. We're balling out today. A little silver I said you brought. Yeah, it didn't work out how I wanted. I was really worried about... Um, what do you call it? I didn't think you'd lead the Mon you led. Right, I'm trying not to spoil our game. I didn't think you'd lead the Mon you led. I thought you would lead the Mon that was last alive. If that makes any sense. And I wanted to immediately grab a lot of offensive momentum and pressure, but it just didn't work out that way. <laughs> but I thought it was a cool idea. I, I was pretty fizzed up on it, too. I was pretty fizzed up on it, too. All right, Dash, you said, too. You said, too. No breakfast, gang. You're supposed to eat breakfast as, as a personal trainer who probably should be eating breakfast. Because um, I know how important it is to eat breakfast. But I woke up a little bit later today. I don't have school this week because of uh, spring break. So I've been taking this as an opportunity to not wake up at 5 a.m. Um... Oh my god. $15 for my two sandwiches alone. Not even including the fries, bro. Um, we're gonna do regular. Make sure we give a tip skis. Oh my god, dude. DoorDash is such a... I don't understand how streamers only eat off of DoorDash, dude. I am paying double what I would pay if I just drove there. Like, if I just drove there, I'm, I'm paying double. It is, it is astronomical the amount of money I'm spending. I had Chick-fil-A when I was in the U.S. was all right, but I didn't get the hype. It's, I feel like also, <laughs> I don't know, other countries probably have much higher quality food and like fast food and things like that. I feel like our bar is pretty low. I love me some Chick-fil-A. And mo honestly, it's mostly because I'm craving it. There are better places I would rather eat, but it's quick. I'm hungry. How's uni going? Hey, it's going. It's going. I wake up at five. I do wake up at five most mornings. I'm waking up at five tomorrow. I'm a personal trainer, so I have a lot of clients really early in the morning before I go to class. Um, but I don't have any on Wednesdays, but I typically have like a 9 a.m. class on Wednesdays, which means I wake up at like 7. But I wake up at 5 most of the time, yes. Um, I have three days of the week where I wake up, four days of the week where I wake up at 5 a.m. Sunday is the only day when I'm in classes that I'm not waking up really, really early. You have your spring break in March? Yeah, yeah. well, I th aren't you also still in high school, friend? I'm, I'm in college, so like it, it's a little bit different depending on who and where. <laughs> All right, my food should be here in 20 minutes, so... 
those of you who are stopping in and haven't ever done a BBR bingo stream with me before, or just a draft league watch through bingo stream with me before, what I like to do is I go through, I watch all these videos. Now, of course, I am going to link every one of the videos in chat. And what I want you guys to do is I want you to go drop a like on the video. If you haven't subbed to the creator, I want you to sub to the creator as well. Um, because, you know, obviously we're, we're technically stealing views from them, right? And I want to make sure that we're supporting these creators, especially in D-League where the whole point is to grow these smaller channels. Um, I really, really want to make sure that we're doing that. So please, please go check out the creator. First up, we're going to be watching Jay Ricky. He's actually in the chat. Um... With his Terra Champ power, I think he's actually playing Oboe, um, and I'll go ahead and link Oboe as well. I think in the description as well, if I remembered and I did it right, I don't stream on YouTube a lot. I used to stream mostly on Twitch, um, but I linked all of the coaches down as well, and you can always, you know, check it out here. Check them all out. Uh, he's playing Oboe, so hold on. Let's copy link address. Let's see if Brody's links actually work. I think someone was saying they don't really work very well. 18 people only one like. Facts. What in the world? I mean, I'm going to like it. I hope you guys like it as well. I'm going to say yes to the question the title asks. It, it might be. It might be a little bit bendable. It might be. Now, uh, but yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to watch these videos as you obviously support them. We're going to watch them on 1.5, even maybe 1.75 times speed, just so we can get through multiple of them. Um, if it lets me. Hello. Oh, it's because it's on an ad. Um, here, I'll let the ad roll while we uh, kind of talk. There's a bingo card above me. I need you guys to pay attention to the game as well and let me know if you see a bingo that I don't. You can see we have a crit that didn't matter. Terra Sweep, triple choice items that can either be all three of them or just three choice items in general. I'm not too picky. Um, benching our round one pick, turn one KO. That was an unskippable. Hold on, let's get this one. A double, draft league player clicks U-turn, which is going to be our free slot. Um, it's not our free slot, but it's our free slot. Um, <laughs> uh, and then uh, three or more hazard layers. So that can be rocks and two spikes, a T spike and two spikes, uh, rock spike, T spike, whatever it is. Three or more hazard layers. Prediction equals a KO. So I say I call a switch and I OCO your switch in. That's that one. A 20 turns or less game, which is going to be a little bit harder for us to track, but if it's a fast game, we can go through and count. Um, oh, I missed, which is missing. Um, did not uh, did not check. It's supposed to be item. So did not check item. My bad. So like um, say they switch in and they show leftovers and the person's like, ah, what if they're choice? Or, you know, they're faster than a mod. They've confirmed scarf. But like, ah, I don't know what item they are. That kind of thing, right? We have no Terra, which means neither player Terra, or let's just, I don't know. You guys let me know. Do you think it should be one player not tearing or both player not tearing? Because I feel like that's like almost impossible. Maybe it'll be one player. Um, three or more heavy duty boots and not noticing. Wait. Oh no. Okay. I'm wrong. Okay. So not noticing revealed item is that one. And then check did not check, which is like, say I brought something to check a specific Pokemon. It did not check it, and I lost, uh, you know, the mom lost to a 1v1 pretty easy. If that makes any sense. Who do we got this week? We have all the D-League coaches. I'm going to try and watch one from the perspective of everyone. Obviously, um, I'm going to be watching them a little bit faster. Hopefully, we get through most of them, if not all. I work at 3.30. I got some food coming, too, so, like, figured this is a perfect time to stream while I'm eating some lunch and just hanging out with you guys. Um, one player seems to Yeah, I think so, too. I think so, too. We have all these guys down here. Um, if you guys have any games in particular you would like me to watch next, if I have any D-League coaches in chat and they're like, hey, can you watch my side? I don't mind. Um, as I do these throughout the whole season, I'm sure I'm going to get to everybody multiple times. I'm not going to, you know, favor one side and only watch this guy because I think they're my favorite and things like that. I think one player is more likely to happen. Okay, so we'll do one player then. I think that's fine. Um, I still think it's pretty unlikely. Um, I think I didn't Terra in my week one pack game. No, I did. I did at the end. It didn't matter though. Um, spoilers. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, like I said, though, if you guys, um, you know, are excited and you want to help me out, please drop a like on the stream. It helps push it out to more people so more people can come hang out with us. Um, and if you're new here, be sure to drop a sub on our way to 2,000. Um, we've been making great strides with all the, you know, hype BBR has been pulling lately. So I would appreciate it a ton if you, uh, you know, want to drop a sub and, uh, you know, support the channel and see our BBR game as it goes up on Wednesday for the main league and things like that. And, you know, catch streams like this and stuff. So, um, yeah, other than that, we got 22 people here. I appreciate y'all. Let's see what we're looking at. We're looking at eight likes. I think we should be at 22, but hey, that's just me. And I am, I even liked it myself. So realistically, 23. But um, yeah, I think it's uh, I think it's time to go. Y'all ready? All right. Well, look at the look at the big the big uh, welcome right here. We're gonna go a little bit faster. Like I said, playing back a little bit faster. If you could watch Thomas versus Seth. Oh, I, I wonder who that Seth guy is. Yeah, because it's voted Game of the Week in Pickums. Yeah, for sure, man. Well, definitely. I mean, I'll get to that one next. Uh, I plan on watching all of them, but we'll see. I think we're going to watch it at 1.5 for now. Maybe we'll speed it up. We'll see. All right. 
to the BDRD League, a draft league where each coach drafts a set Oh, I love the ending. I love the effort. I love to see it. This is how you get Oh, I love it. Obo and his grand rapids goldingo. If you do go on to enjoy the video, this. Really like, comment and subscribing. The support is great. Of course, of course, of course. As you can tell straight away, our opponent has an insanely scary team with so many offensive threats. All right, let's look. Let's look. Let's give our own analysis. Um I know that Obo is Terra Electric Champau, which means it is a menace in this game an absolute menace but also obo super duper struggles with d knight like really really struggles with d knight when you're like normal immune is going to be something like a gengar and then your normal resist is going to be something like a klefki either like lum d knight or just like d knight playing carefully around those t waves catching it with a um fire punch or eq is going to be really tough honestly just eq eq plus e speed just like massacres this team whether it be dd um band is also really really viable in this game if he feels he can keep hazards away but it, that, that form removal is colossal espion, so I don't know. I don't know. Imagine being able to edit stuff. <laughs> um, I don't know if you already played it, but if you will, I'll be a member for three. I appreciate the support. Who doesn't struggle with Terra Dina? That's honestly fair. I mean, it, that is that is honestly fair. I mean, we have two absolutely ridiculous mons. Plus, I, I think, like, I actually, so I love Ovo's team. I love the start of his team in particular. That Pow, Garchomp, Cinderace, like, start is mwah, chef's kiss. Some of the, some of the cores these D-League teams have blow my mind but then i remember they drafted two pools um but d knight bundle plus like ting lu hazards zoomerl which is the best fairy in the format in my opinion um at least right now um, in my personal opinion i think it's the best fairy in the format um spikes on deck too we have so much spikes the glade that we forgot to move up in price in two leagues in a row um balloon gengar walls eq so that is something that's true and i do know as kurt is a man who has brought in and drafted gengar so many times when Kurt played D Knight last season, I think it was against Vivid, um, who didn't actually even bring it against him in week eight. Um, he brought um, Air Balloon Gengar with enough EVs to live a plus one Adamant Fire Punch, um, which it wasn't that much. So that could definitely be something that um, J Ricky accounts for, though, and going Fire Punch over EQ. Uh, because realistically, EQ is only for Gengar keys. And if you're okay with just a little bit less damage, um, I think that Fire Punch is fine. Because Fire Punch plus E Speed will definitely kill keys, even if it's like, you know, pretty bulky. So. D League teams are pretty good for the most part. Oh, for sure, for sure. So, seven point glade. So, you got seven point glade because I forgot to move it up. That one was my bad, right? We forgot to move it up. But then in main, fun fact, I said, Daniel, please change this shit to like 11. I think it was like 11 or 12 when we moved it up. I said, like, please change it. I messed up. I've forgotten D League. Please move it up here. And he said, word, bet. Put the 12 in the wrong spot on the dock, and Matt got seven point glade in the draft. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, Great, great. Can't really see Oboe's team. Oh, my bad. Here, let me hide the uh, bingo really quick just so you guys can see. Oop, that's not the right image. Bingo. There we go. Um, The last one down here is Glimit, so it doesn't count as a Pokemon. Don't worry. Um, But yeah, I mean, D Knight looks crazy. Bundle looks astronomically insane. Um, Free Jai Pump just nukes everything, provided he hits his pumps. Um, Azu, good soft check to a lot of the offense. Um, Now, that Terra Pow makes it a little bit worse, and obviously you can hit that Gung Skis on the... Uh, Cinderace and things, but it, it checks the hell out of Quackleball. It checks guard. This is what I mean. It is so anti-meta. It's so annoying to switch into and try and kill. Love me some Azu. Um, Ting Lu is going to set up a million spikes. He's going to check Chomp. Um, I do think that the Cinderace matchup is a bit dire. The Cinderace matchup is a bit dire from J. Ricky's side. Um, for sure. Give Gal give Gengar Levitate again. Then we don't even have to be Air Balloon. Um, though I like Curse Body. I think Curse Body is actually better in, in a lot of niche uh, instances. So we'll look at his team. Really quick. He is Fire Punch, which is a smart brain with Lum. I, I like this a lot. This set's going to do really, really well, especially if we can keep those hazards away, potentially. It doesn't look like we have a means of doing so. Um, but yeah. And then we have Protective Pads, Glade, Sharpness, um, Sneak for the Priority for the Gengar, which is pretty darn cool um, to pick it off, as well as just like dual stabs ripping everything on this team. Oop, is there anything right here? Um, and then we're Dual Screens, Keys. Uh, we are Boots, um, Taunting Bundle, which is cool. And then uh, Rocks plus Lefties Protect. And I love me some Lefties Protect, especially when I'm on, like, Ting Lu. Um, very, very clean. Just Draft Haunter. So true. He deserves Levitate that. <laughs> I saw Glimit, Glimit the Goat. I mean, maybe, maybe. Um, it's worse for me and never activates. You know, that that might be, as the kids say, a skill issue. Now, we can see what Obro brought. Obro, it's so, and it threw me off. Is that me? Um... We have Chimpow, Quack, Keys, Toad Scroll, who's actually low key a demon. Great hazard remover in this game, actually. Um, whether it was going to be Spikes Keys, which I don't think it is, um, but it stuffs Keys actually pretty well, decently. Um, and then whether it be for like Ting Lu, if Ting Lu wanted to set up a bunch of Spikes, they could spin pretty freely on this team, which I see why Spike Stack didn't come in particular. Um, I think having the rocks is pretty important, but like Spikes in particular kind of got stuffed by the uh, the Toad Scroll. 
Gengar came, I'm assuming Scarf in a matchup like this, right? Like, I, I feel like it low-key has to be Scarf. Now, obviously, Ting Lu is a bit of an issue, um, but it's going to be an issue for really any set that you want to run. You can't reliably run any Resist Berries. I mean, even plus two Nasty Plug, like, Focus Blast aren't going to be doing anything. Um, where Scarf gives you a Revenger to plus one D Knight um, after, a, what do you call it? After a DD, which I think is pretty cool. So, we're going to see a lead bundle, though. Um we're going to go ahead and jump into it, though. I'm going to scoot scoot ahead a little bit. Scoot ahead. Now, again, so excited to keep an eye up here for me, guys. Timer. Keep an eye up here for me, guys. So deflating, so it was very, very unfortunate. So he leads off with uh, DJ Khaled, which ends up being his... The keys. Uh, you don't want to take a T-Wave, right? Wave, so yeah, you sure really don't want to take a T-Wave. Uh, kind of... Ting is super free. Hmm, do I, I do think that Ting is very free. Yeah. I mean, because, like, what is he going to do? Gleam? And do three and a half? We'll be able to dodge the Thunder Wave, obviously, because not only am I a ground type, but I am also a dark type, which means Prank will not work on me we might just see some oh i love the edits too we're cutting out the dead space i love it I'm fairly certain that this thing uh that the toad scroll is going to come in so did he did he screen i'm sorry i actually didn't see that. okay he did screen he did screen i also have screens well if you have a cleft in front of you you probably expect screens uh, and the ruination miss is tough too that chip is really really nice i think you get up rocks yeah he's low-key wasting his own screen turns too which really isn't like great yeah i mean that 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 gleam is like almost healing him i think you're just ruination again yeah i mean you're not really threatened by this you can start like cycling protects too if you want to stay in here you kind of designate that he's okay with taking chip um, Theodore the Toad Scroll comes out, which is nice. It's gonna come out and it, it does stuff this to an extent, but like, get it? You just got off sixty percent on it. Super free. Super free. Timer nighting nice is oh, it, it is so much nicer. So spoilers. I just watched. It was a late game for week one. Um, John's game versus Mephesto. It was a very, very good game. Um, and he streamed it to us in call. So, like, I already saw, I didn't know what happened. And I'm in the league, so I know what happened beforehand too. But it was a fifty minute game. We played a 50 minute game in Gen 9 Wi Fi, which is like insane. And neither of them were stressed. They weren't, they didn't come close to timing out. It was such a nice, it was, it was such a nice feeling. Oh, it was great to watch. I think I'm going to go aggressive into the Gallade. I like the Glade Pivot because if he decides to spin away the rocks, you get a really, really free Sacred Sword off. Um, or even Psycho Cut. Honestly, probably even a Psycho Cut. Um, and uh, if he wants to sport, it's probably the most least, like, you know, needed member for the team. I didn't even know it could miss. Isn't it like 95? Oh, wait, we had a move miss. You guys, you guys need to step it up and keep an eye on this bingo board, okay? We need to step it up and keep an eye on this bingo board because we had a move miss. Oh, I missed. Come on. What are we doing? Um, where, wait, why is my Photoshop bugging? Wait, why is my Photoshop bugging? I don't see any of my tools. <laughs> um, that's not good. That's not good. Um, what the? All my, my, my sidebar, my Photoshop is gone. Image. Um, hello? Where, where did my images? Oh my God, that's not good. Okay, I might have to download a check mark. I might have to download a check mark. All right, I'm going to do that on the side while you guys watch this game a little bit. Hold on. <laughs> I my my Photoshop is bugging. I can't like make like all my tools in my Photoshop are gone. Foul play did a ton. That's actually really cool. I mean, this one was damn near dead. Unfortunately. I don't think this thing goes for a grass type attack at all. Like I think another foul play is just the most likely thing. Either that or he just goes for rapid spin. And if he goes for rapid spin, I don't think he'll be able to outspeed me the following. The spin is tough. I do think that if he's low key fast, he should he actually has the possibility of outspeeding. I'm actually pretty curious. On that, let's see. Let's see a bundle. I obviously I don't know spreads, and if you guys ever want to drop it in here, that's that's fine as well. Let's see Toad Scroll. I guess it depends obviously on how bulky he is, but like if he is more offensive. Oh my goodness, he gets really fast. Um, he actually can be modest. He could be non-boosting up to what is it? 140 mod. Oh my goodness. Wait, this thing's going sickle mode right now. Yeah, okay, so you recognize it. That's good. That's good. Um, that's good. Yeah, and you get to kind of gauge and see what his speed stat is. That was scary, though. <laughs> we might have stayed in there. 
I don't um, so unfortunate pivot, pivot, but I think screen not the end of the world. Yeah, he's got one more turn of uh, reflect. Yeah, I think he goes for thunder wave here. I'm working on downloading this check mark too, guys. Um, don't worry, I got it. The next turn. I do have a lumberry, but Let's see if this is actually a good PNG so site. Able to catch him off guard with it. So if we can chip it down a little bit, I think that will be the uh, best case scenario. So he goes for thunder wave. Uh, he is going to end up missing, which is nice. So we get a free liquidation essentially, and uh, he doesn't really have a switch into a banded liquidation. So okay. This should do giant amount of damage to anything. Even if he's fizzed, I have to take like seven percent minimum for them from this thing. So what is to happening to my Photoshop? If he is, um, if he is physically defensive or not, liquidation comes off. That did about forty-ish percent. So I would say. I did about 40 percent, so I would say that is physically defensive. I would say that is physically defensive. Um, I'm kind of down to just go ahead and click liquidation again. Okay, we'll be back. Don't worry. He might thunderwave me, but I'm okay with having this thing thunderwave. Like, not being able to move would be annoying, but I really don't need the speed on this thing for anything. So I mean, if anything's to going to take a thunderwave, it's probably this, uh, especially being the glade is sleeping. Come in, set up on it, and this thing being chipped is super, super nice for that D night end game. It is so nice for that D night end game. I mean, you're getting to the point where you can just click E speed, which also covers like scarf wisping gar. Um, awesome. it's just really nice is out of here so we won't have to be able to deal with screens anymore we won't be able to or we won't be able to we won't have to deal with yeah and no more screens the rest of the game which is pretty, pretty nice. really really nice this bring in this brings in the chien pao right yeah the chien pao which is, he's definitely okay. terrestrialized into an electric type he's definitely terrestrializing into an okay we have no miss do we have any other i think klepki is a play this thing is mad scary though mad scary do we have any other that we've hit sorry i have not been looking at chat because of that i noticed but i didn't say anything see that's that's the problem we need you we need to we need to say things my ceiling of might. He didn't say, oh, I missed, though. You know what? It's, we, we need more, uh, well, we, we need more editing from Mr. J. Ricky, though. He needs to edit in that specific, like, TikTok noise. The, oh, I missed. <laughs> um, my ceiling might has cool niche applications. And especially being that, like, it's only, it's only status move that it's consistently clicking in my mind is probably Spore. Other than that, I think it's okay because it's decent, it's decently okay offensively. Like, it, ground plus grasp was, like, the weird, like, Fairy and foul play and I think sludge bomb coverage that it gets is pretty solid and like having a negative priority spore is unfortunate but like you can spore or toxic a um garganacle or goldango too which is a nice thing now not goldango is probably not switching in very well but say it's balloon or something like that um you can kind of you know deal with it that way which is nice um it's not it's not that bad but you know and, and yeah and you can spore magic bounce stuff which is cool yeah that's what we're gonna see okay uh, and we do see a terra so unfortunately there's no uh there's no terra one Right, uh, which then would allow me to go into Klepki, but it's fine because we, we just like this thing is probably gonna be like 70% to me, I think. All right, let's oh, go back to camera roll. Uh, I'm gonna change bingo so it should change in my stream. Oh, he crit me. Is that did a lot of damage, dude? He had key, dude. P Pow is so damn strong that he has keys plus Azumarill, and the matchup is still dire. Is that a double? Um, was there a double? Was there a double? I'm trying to think if there was a double. We've all zero. No, he just switched out. I don't think that was a double. I think he just switched. So we get the reflect up. Yeah. Oh, you're talking about that. Yeah. I'm. Yeah. Yeah. Earlier. Yeah. I don't think that's a double because yeah, he wasn't. It wasn't like with a sole intent of doing so. I think I might set up a light screen just. You might as well set up a screen unless you have spikes, but you're not spikes. You're two wave. Yeah. So I'm just gonna go ahead and set up a light screen. Yep. The light screen we can see that come off and for sure for another terror blast. I would assume. Yeah. And it goes down. That's a check that did not check. You know what? That that is fair. That is a check that did not so check. Go, go I actually agree. Control C, Control V. I don't think this thing is scarfed, right? Like it wouldn't really make any sense for him to be choice scarfed against my team when the only thing he would outspeed would be Iron Bundle. I feel like he want to be able to switch up moves. So I'm just gonna go ahead and flip turn. There's no Draft League player clicks momentum too. You turn is flip turn. I've decided, by the way. That that is the same thing, and you cannot change my mind. Look at this. J Ricky just smashing the terror or the bingo board for us. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna go out into Dragonite. I'm going to go out into Dragonite. This thing, I know this thing does have spell. Okay. I just want to see how much it's, uh, it's spell play. I mean, but doing. you're 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 multi scaled. This seems super free. Like this DD seems so. Oh, with a with a reflect up. Plus one with multi scale and everything. Um, spell play still isn't going to do very much. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, spell play. No, nothing. If you like scarf Gengar or scarf something in the back, I I think it's still fine. This is going to outspeed me. Yeah, that did. Yeah, like you can DD again in its face. You don't even have to roost. Like <laughs> this this is super fine. This is super fine. Oh, but the reflect went off. The, the reflect is gone now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and fire punch. We'll just go ahead and fire punch. This is super free. And, uh, I don't really want to play around with that. So we'll just go ahead and fire punch. And then if he goes Gengar, he goes Gengar. Check did not check. Whether it was a crit or not, check did not check. Oh, he used helmet too. So he always secured no um. I think this is the proper play. So he goes Jackson, which is no helmet or whatever. Okay, and he's uh, he is air balloon, which also makes sense. For a fire punch to do anything effective. So I think I'm going to. 
go out into Tinglu. You keep the glade sack for later. Mistake, but I might have a chance to set up later on in the game. Um, and honestly, you probably do on something like no, yeah. I mean, even if it's Willow Cinder, you still have your Lum, which is such a nice thing about taking care of that um Klefki and having it so low in range where it's like in range of like a plus one E speed. Like he's chilling. He's doing. You're doing fine. It definitely has another opportunity. We're gonna see a poison. Oh no, sir! You just healed off damage when you got attacked by a Gengar. You do have the balloon skis. Don't. Okay, so he. I was gonna say if he didn't notice it was balloon or he forgot and clicked earthquake, that would have been another one. This bounces. I'm surprised he's willing to do this. And now D Knight wins. This is like the only thing stopping D Knight from winning the game immediately. Um, at least it feels that way. Because uh, rocks could be the difference between uh, extreme speed killing something and not killing something. So we'll go ahead and click um, rocks now. I don't think Cinderace is going to have anything that is going to be able to hit hmm. at all. So I think Cinderace could be an option for me to set up. Uh, he's going to, yeah, it definitely can set up on it again. As long as you don't Terra, you're fine. Just don't Terra yet, which he hasn't done yet. Uh, we got the rocks up. Yeah, this is, Sledgeon did not, no, it, it moved it just in the opposite direction after left him. <laughs> it moved it just the wrong way. Um, completely moved it. I don't know, that is something that is crossing my mind. Because, like, Gallade is asleep. It still has another sleep turn, right? And if he's... If he yeah, has, it hasn't burned any, I don't think. I, I don't know if this is going to count as a... Uh, no, it burned one. It burned one. So. But there's no guarantee. It's not guaranteed. Four four. This man is insane King Lou, baby. This man is insane with the focus blast. Um, I'm just going to go and click Shadow Sneak. I mean, if you wake up right here, you're in a good spot. <laughs> you KO this and then force some pretty good offensive positioning for your own self. Imagine hitting two focus blasts. Imagine running focus blast. It's crazy. That's fine. I think I am going to move down the, the, what do you call it? Just so we can see the, uh, the health bar at the very least of the Gengar. Because I know you guys actually could not see that. My bad. It's playing a little bit better, right? Freeze dry. Pick it off. There it goes. But I'm looking crazy right now, too. Like, if he's not Scarf Cinder, he also just gets rocked by this. I love his shiny, too. What a cute little guy. What an absolute cute little guy. Just give him Surf. Give him Surf. That's all I'm asking. Just give him Surf. Maybe you don't give him surf because he might be bannable with surf with like a more reliable stab. Dude, this dies. This is not kill. It's almost picking up the kill, but not quite yet. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna click hydro pump. I'm gonna. I mean, yeah, you take this damage and puts it in range of E speed, but like it doesn't kill. I feel like it kills. Oh shit! It did live. I mean, that's fine. Again, the the D9 end game is there. The D9 end game is 100 percent there. You just go into it and you click E speed. I had such fire nicknames this week. Um, we're gonna go out into Dragonite now. There's also no hazards up, right? Oh yeah, huge. Huge. Not Terrascalize, we simply click the extreme speed. Very, very good idea. We're also seeing no Terra. Come on, don't Terra for me. Don't Terra for me. Let's see it. You have Lum, you're fine. Yeah, there's literally nothing that the Cinderace can do to you if you do not Terra. So don't Terra so I get my bingo card. Don't Terra so I get my bingo card. Let's see it. Let's see if my food's here. Darwin Nunez, his Cinderace. What is this thing? Oh, my food was dropped off, so I'm gonna go grab that after this game. Confused. Uh, dragon dance. You dragon dance in this thing's face. I mean, he can willow spew, but yeah, you're you're willow. I don't think, right? Oh, but then you then you definitely should Terra after this. Damn it! I don't think I'm missing anything. I think the best. I mean, you. <laughs> it depends. I mean, plus plus one speed definitely kills. Okay, but I didn't so that skill did so much. Ow! Holy crap! Goodness gracious! I think an extreme speed takes this thing out now. It does. Anyone have you with the games been so far? This is our first one, so you're here early. We do have three bingo cards. We were gonna have four, but he decided to Terra, unfortunately. Ooh, clean little can clean little transaction. That was nice. This dies. Yeah, it's not. Okay, so this should pick up the kill. Yes, it does. And then the last mod he has is the Quaquable. Not sure how much extreme speed is going to do to... Um, it, I don't think it matters, but I think this kills. I, I I would be very surprised if this did not kill. If you're like adamant plus one Terra normal E-speed. Woo! So Goodness! So Dragonite goes down, but I think... I think Azu just comes in here and uh, cleans up. Unless we get yeah, super unless you get super unlucky with Paris. <gasps> Wait, that's mad scary. Wait, that's mad scary. Wait, you, you're like one para and a crit away from the game being over. I mean, yeah, Jet definitely kills, but... Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Throw it up. Alright, there we go. Terror Sweep? No. No, it wasn't a Terror Sweep. No Terror Sweep, because the D-Knight died there at the end. It would have been one. No Terror Sweep, unfortunately. So, big shout out to Jay Ricky. Good game to him. Um, I think we were told Gentleman Thomas game was, um, the, what do you call it, game of the week? Let's see. B 
BBRD. Oh, he's got the moon skis. Look at him go. He's got the moon skis. I think this is him versus dashing, right? I don't know if jo dashing is still here. I'm not in BBR, so I can't get things. Six up by J. Ricky, dude. With that D-Knight bundle, it might happen. He might not even be in the league. He might just catch a stray, which is pretty nasty. But GG, J. Ricky, I appreciate you uh, letting us watch your game. I'm going to link this next one from Gentleman Thomas. Be sure to go ahead, drop a like on it. Go check out Mr. Dashing Septile, too. Um, where is he? My channel, my Twitter, CL Cigalit, it's down here. Um, where is Mr. Dash and Subtile? Here it is. Go check him out as well. Again, I want you guys, if you're not subbed to these coaches, sub to him. That's how we grow the community. We can, uh, you know, draft get bigger. Oh, Thomas is here too. Perfect, perfect. Okay. All right, I'm going to take a two-second hiatus. Two-second hiatus. And I'm going to go grab my Chick-fil-A because I am mad hungry. And it's out there. So I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere just yet. Not just yet. Give me one sec. Professional streamer man gets uh gets DoorDash for, for lunch. Because he's too lazy to make his own food while he's streaming or before he's streaming. Quick everybody like the video. Quick, 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 quick. Okay. Alright, so apparently this is voted as game of week in Pick'ems. And also join the BBR server if you haven't already. I mean, I feel like the entire world has joined the BBR server in the last week. There's been so many people joining, and I really, really do appreciate it. Um it's been awesome to see how how much traffic and um, hype there's been for this season, um, whether it be D-League or Main League. But if you guys want to join and check out the Main League games, um, I won't be doing watchthroughs for the Main League. I think actually Pokemon's going to be doing them, which will be really, really cool. I'm definitely excited to watch those um, and all the other coaches as well as all the D-League guys. So go ahead and join that. I think it's in the description right here um, or someone can link it if it's not. Um, but yeah. Oh, dude, I love the effort we're seeing in these videos. I love it. What's up, Zep Top? Okay. And we're still gonna do, you know, some traditional stuff that I do in this channel, but I'm gonna really make team builder fast. But we wanna be we are playing. Do appreciate the fast team builders as well. As I take my insulin underneath the desk really quick. I don't know if YouTube will yell at me if I take an insulin shot on stream. And Dashing Sector team is very scary and it consists of Terra, Chi Yu, Corviknight, and I live Ooh, the Terra Chi Yu skis. I am very interested, Seth, as to why you went Terra now it's not I'm not saying this is like a bad thing. I am interested to see as to why you went Terra Chi Yu instead of Annihilate. Because my way of thinking, right, and I talked I talked to D-Ray about this because he was super torn in main because he has the same core that you do, is why Terra Chiyu over Terra Ape? And since I think Terra Chiyu is incredible, but it's a mon that functions very well without Terra, whereas I feel like Annihilate really, really wants it to function to the best of its abilities. It really, really wants it. So I don't know if that's something that you might want to change in the future or at least look into, look into your future matchups and things like that before transactions are out. Um... But I do think that it might be beneficial because Terra, Terra Ape, dude, and I would go, uh, if I'm you, I'm going Ghost Fairy probably. Ghost Fairy, Ghost Water, uh, depending on your team, what you feel you're more weak to. Um, I really, or a Spothra, yeah, I I kind of want to say, I think a Spothra without Terra, that, that might even be the move unless you drop that thing. I think it without Terra is not a very good Pokemon, but it's also a big noob killer, um, and that's always a big thing on Wi-Fi, you know what I mean? But, we'll see. Spothra is a Pokemon. Terra Chiyu is a KO monster. Well, could you imagine, like, Terra Ape into this team, or even Terra Spothra goes crazy into this team. Terra Spothra goes crazy into this team. Um, he has, like, Parasong and fucking, um, Scream Tail Boy, and that's it. <laughs> but we can go ahead and jump into it. We've seen the matchup. I kind of want to just look at what he brought. Sep, if you want to drop what you have, that'd be cool, too. We see Charty Berry, Terra Flying, Acrobatic. Charty is cool. Um, because as long as that, I wonder if that plus one, if he kills the Lycanroc, though, with a plus one Throat Chop. That'd be interesting to see. Throat Chop is cool for the Sylveon, obviously. Um, Acro is really strong into this team. Uh, and once he starts boosting up, he can honestly, like, you know, DD Roost all over Core V as well, especially with that Terra Flying. Moth Core is pretty cool. I have seen Moth Core is pretty cool. Um... Who sniped Volk from the left team? Yeah, they need to go to prison because it was. We almost had the triple Mothcore. 
Um, but yeah, I, I do think that this is a very, very good set in the Mr. Dash and Sceptile. Um, we have a Boots, uh, just four attacks Moth, which also does really, really well. Um, let's look. Sludge Wave, Fiery Dance, Gleam, or Fire Blast, Gleam, Sludge Wave, Gleam, Energy Ball, Sludge Wave, slash Fire Blast, any attack, or I guess Energy Ball, actually. Fire Blast, Fire Blast. Yeah, this thing is nasty into your team. This thing is nasty. Set was made to set up on Corf. I, I figured it could definitely set up all over. As long as it's not like a um like an iron defensing set. But even then, like if you're terra flying and you're bulky, you're probably fine. Um so this thing's really, really strong. Uh we have a choice banding Slitherwing. Um uh, with dual wing beat U turn close combat first impression. Um first impression is gonna be nice to like prevent a non protecting a spot throw, but it's probably going to be. Dual wing beat is for I'm assuming Ape and, like, Spide Ops lead. Is this the lead? I'm not, like, watching this whole thing. One boot, good eyes, can't keep an eye on the boot. Um, but I'm wondering, is it is it dual wing beat because of the case of, like, a Spide Ops lead to keep away webs, guaranteed? I'm uh, watching this thing. You can post it here, or you can DM me on Discord. Either way works. I don't mind. Either way works. Um, then we have Ring Target Tricking Rotom, which makes sense into the Gastro. It's nasty ply. It's pretty offensive, too, which actually does really well. Um, if you can trick that Gastro... It really, really puts a lot of pressure on his fat cores. Um, screen tail. We do have we do have the wishing parish songing uh, screen tail here, which is pretty cool. We do see an encore as well. Um, without protecting it, a little bit scary because like I think this set like stuffs the stored power set. But something that's really scary is like Lumina Crash plus um, Shadow Ball can get really, really out of hand really, really fast. And then we have Big Muds uh, with just Fizz Def the Helmet. Um, I'm assuming it's here to roar around that. Annihilate, but if it's Taunt Ape, honestly, Taunt Ape is looking a little bit scary. Um, depending on how you can position things like Screen Tail and um, I guess Iron Moth is really your only way of revenging it once it gets boosted up. Um, so I think that Ape has a really, really viable chance to win this game. Sent. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look. You're gonna start speeding through these a little bit though. Oh, I'm mad slow. My team reached down Thomas. Let's see. Might not be the best like. Set up though. We have a uh, Scarf Terrifier, Chiyu. I'm assuming your fairies are secondary typing, right? Um, Espothra is Life Orb, Lumina Crash. I like this set a lot into this team. I think this set is going to do really, really well into Thomas's team. That's a great idea, and I love the Life Orb too. Super, super offensive, and with the beautiful set. I love it. We do see Taunt Bulk Up, which I do also think is the best set into the squad. Um, we have a Sashing Endeavoring um, Lycan Rock with just three attacks, Endeavor, um, Drill, and Stone Edge. That's pretty cool. Um, a bit interesting. Oh no, you don't have the Corvi. I don't know how well it's going to work into Mudsdale. Um, I guess you at least get the Endeavor off. I think having rocks might have been a little bit more optimal over something like Drill Run. I'm trying to think with Drill Run. Yeah, because like, I don't know, I guess you don't hit Tink then, but I, I feel like Suicide leading this off to secure rocks and 99% on something might have been a little bit more beneficial. Um, and then you could go a Cell Rock Stone Edge, or you could even go a Cell Rock Plus. Um, what do you call it? Um, drill Run. Could be another option, potentially, but just look at that. Uh, then we just have a Defog and Corvi, and then a Boots, um, Max HP Cyclozar. What is that for? Boots, Max HP Cyclozar. What he checking? What does Cyclozar check? Do you mind telling me, like, why in particular the Cyclozar is coming? Three plus boot. Yeah, it has to be three plus boots on the same team. Three on the same team. <laughs> that would, uh, we would, we'd probably already have it by now otherwise. It has to be three on the same team. Which seems crazy, but I don't know. If you've played draft league long enough, you should know that boots are broken. Um, the Southern set is very nice here. Um, but yeah, we can go ahead and jump into it though. Let's jump into the battle. How much time? Also, if I remember, I'll do my best to remove the monster during battle. If I forget the first week or two, I'm sorry. Let's see. We're gonna go one point seven five though, so we can get through games a little faster. All right, we can start eating. I need you guys to keep an eye on that bingo card. All right, I am but one man who forgets lots of things. Slitherwing is kind of a good lead, but no, we're gonna leave a Rotom. Mm. Gonna leave a Rotom. That's that was the. I'm surprised to see no Slither lead, but that's the biggest thing in the world. Especially because the lead Corvi seems pretty likely, and the trick really early on into the Rotom. Ooh, I haven't seen someone play here yet. That's what I imagined was gonna be his lead. All right, I'm just gonna click. Okay, the layout looks to be yeah, looks to be perfect actually. This is tough okay. because like he should fear Wisp here and probably go Gastro, but also in a generation like this. Gastro's pretty tough into the Rotom. Um, 
unless it's a set that like specifically just cannot touch Gastro. Gastro can't really do much back, and it can be exploited with like sub nasty plot sets. Um, now what fourth coverage move you go? It's kind of tough. Um, but honestly, like a like a sub nasty plot Thunderbolt Hyper Voice set, it does get Hyper Voice. I feel like it doesn't. I have no idea why I said Brodom gets Hyper Voice. Might trip him. Let's see what coverage could it get. Dude, even Terra Blast, just like as neutral coverage, could be super nasty. Like some nasty Terra, Terra Blast Thunderbolt. That sounds pretty clean. Or Dark Pulse is another option, obviously, as well. Um, so that's the only issue. So I could definitely see, uh, what do you call it? Dashing Fling a Knock here, which makes this trick play a little bit more iffy. Yeah, you know, bring Gastro. Good catch. <laughs> Good catch. So he has the cycle sock. Loki Ah, I don't know. It's it's a bit tough with that mud still sitting in the back. I, I like the idea of Sash Endeavor or like I don't know. It's a bit tough with that mud still in the back. So I don't know. Okay, so I do have to think a little bit fast because even though we have a full hour, the, each individual is still. Yeah, I think this is like the best one because he's he's gonna taunt me. Okay. He's probably gonna assume. That also makes sense. Well, no, I probably wouldn't. There's no trick. But now he vaults. He probably thinks your choice too. Yeah, so he's gonna knock off. It's fine. I'm getting a soul switch here. No ring target. I mean, trick is pretty useless unless you're taking an item from something now, but not the biggest deal in the world. I didn't pay attention to how much we did. I feel like going. Little wing here is pretty good. So there's free. Still is fine to get. Yeah, to get rocks up immediately. It's a very, very free U turn. Let's go into Mudsteel and get rocks up. He can he can stay in the spin if he really wants to. All right, remember I have to cut these. I have to put his monsters 50, right? Interesting. Uh, we are in with Mudsdale now. I mean, he can't spin, but he also doesn't really force much progress himself. But I'm just gonna, I'm just you know, gonna up a little bit. He could go. Actually, he could go very little knife. Pretty tough. Okay, Taunt. man. If I could, I could that, that is also something that he did just show. Um, I am interested though that he didn't want to take in. He wanted to stay and take that body press, but I won't give him the boost for Rage Fist. So I'm gonna, but but if he goes, he should go Corvy. Oh, it's dead. No, it's dead. It's gone. Yeah, no, it's gone. That's clean. Now you get a Brock Slater and you're good. You get a Brock Slater and you're good. Yeah, that's 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 phenomenal. That's amazing. I am very surprised no Corvi Piffit. Um, especially being that it was taunted. I mean, I guess it could have smacked down, but then you U-turn again. Uh, I don't know. This team does struggle with this in general, though. Switching into it, it's really annoying. If it was like a, if this was like SmackDown offensive from Septile's perspective, he really struggled with it. Like he really struggled with it. So he goes annihilate. I think I'm staying in and just. Oh wait, I'm taunted still, aren't I? Mm -hmm. uh, why the check status? Taunt. There's one more turn. And no more helmet. Hmm. That's annoying. I can go. I can go to a scream tail, like a hot scream tail. You can go scream tail because the rage fist isn't boosted yet, so it's gonna bounce. Um. Only issue. And from there, what you encore? Yeah, I think you can encore. Yeah, I, I think scream tail is pretty safe. Who's matchup? Who versus who? There's Septile versus Thomas right now. There's a second game of the day. Second game of the day so far. That is them. They're both here. Yeah, no, Encore is for sure the play. And then you could just off Gleams. Very freely. The Encore is actually really annoying. Not just for this thing, um, but for everything else in this team. Things like Corvi, locking the Roost, it burns extra Roost, or if it wants to defog, or if it wants to... You know, whatever it may be, this one's gonna be a demon. So, Moth makes sense because it probably two hit KOs as long as it two hit KOs, right? If you spit F. If it two hit KOs, spit F, I think you're fine. Or if you have enough turns to three hit KO, because it also covers the Corfi pivot right here, which is very, very likely. Like, also very much so covers that pivot. So, I think that's fair as well. I think that's the biggest reason you do it. If you're not expecting the Corvid Poop, you just stay in and gleam because you can continuously lock him into bulk up. But I think he should. Oh no, he's gonna go. Yeah. Oh no. He's always going Corby. Yeah. There's no way it's not Corvid. Okay, I'm pretty like this is not bad because it means he won't ever stay in. We don't have rocks or anything else. I think if anything, he's gonna he's gonna what's it called U turn out. Is my is my guess. I think I actually might just wish here. Just quickly check. My head doesn't do that much. Oh wait, I'm on. Then you get a free switch into something else a little bit later. Man, that Chiu looks so scary. If it's like a wish variant. I think he's gonna be like an iron defense set. I don't think it makes sense in this man. This matchup, yeah, he does just use iron defense. Perfect. Mm. Even if he's iron defense, so makes it, for a really good bit. Like, it, it doesn't. Good yeah. Means that, um, what's it called? So then maybe the play was just to stay in and gleam, well, if that's the case. Um, um, but I do think that that pivot from him is definitely very likely. I can't speak. He went. He went to spot throw on me. Wow. That's this is literally my my spot throw counter. Huh. 
You just pair song again. You have to, because you don't know if it's um, you don't know if it's CM or whatever it may be. The only one, because well, no, I'm gonna go before him actually. Did he gleam him? Because like he he doesn't do anything to me really. As bad as he is, well, actually, if he's like an offensive variant already, I guess. Mhm. Mm um, if he has like the special attack and has like shadow ball, I think he gets mm -hmm. shadow ball. Uh, I'm gonna be gleam to see what he wants to do, because I can stay in and I can okay, protect. So he is like a speed boosting variant. I mean, that's fine. This is really good positioning from Septile. This is really good positioning from him. Like, this is some pretty incredible positioning, because now, you die, if you want to stay him, you have not revealed any information about your set, and you throw off the freest Lumina Crash of all time. The freest Lumina Crash of all time. And because of that, you should be able to pick a KO. Mm-hmm. This is incredible positioning. This is really good positioning from Sotile. You sack it off, basically. He doesn't know we have Roy yet. Actually, wow, yeah, I got caught by my- I didn't keep up with my own character's song, that's really, really annoying. Mm -hmm. Cause I had I done that, I actually probably might have done Slitherwing on this. Cause- Cause he Lumina Crash that does a lot, yeah, that was a lot. Okay, so I don't think he's the setup variant. Mm -mm. Lumina Crash. To our Mudsdale. Does- he, he did- he did a lot, you know, he- he is probably offensive. I think. Do you not see the item? Like, there's no way he is. Do you not see the item? Does that count, guys? Does that count as not seeing the item? You can't see the percentages and whatnot. Again, this is my first uh, uh, Wi-Fi battle, so I'm a little- He didn't see the item, come on, does that count? Please tell me that counts. I feel like that might count. Back into screen tail because he still wouldn't be able to really kill us. And I'm gonna, I'm just gonna parasol and then probably hot swap. I think. Yeah, I, not being able to keep count of my own parasol was really annoying. I, I completely forgot that. Luna crash. Okay, it does nothing. We do two twenty one to one eighty six on our screen tail. Dude, this thing looks really scary. One eighty six. So he did, he did sixteen percent of Luna crash. Okay, that suggests he has some sort. He's not life orb. Okay, I'm gonna parasol. Ah, yes. He said he's not life orb. He said he's not life orb. Let's go. Let's go. I'm sorry you didn't notice. But let's go. I can't really figure out what the hell this thing is. Oh my gosh, it killed, crash. dude. Oh, I, need, I need to write them. them. It's like Shadow Ball, Lumina Crash. That is astronomical uh, damage. Oh, do I lose here? I might actually. Mm, I mean, he doesn't have any, sp he doesn't have any boosts, right? I also you might have to burn the moon right now. Nothing doing. You might have to burn moon right now. Hold on. Uh, yeah. Not noticing mean? revealed item. Let's go, dude. Lumina Crash. He, I'm, I'm assuming that he has. Hey, Let's go. Right I missed it again, a death counts. Yeah, and he said he's not life orb. Those words. Mm hmm. Let's go. So, yeah, I'm, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to terrestrialize. You have to. And I'm just going to throw chop. Right? Even if he protects, it's not the worst. Mm -hmm. he has, if his last move is sword power instead of. That's, a, that's really, really bad for us. But I can't risk it being deep. I mean, no, because sword power probably doesn't even do as much as Lumina at this point. Yeah. You're supposed to hard call the terror, too. Yeah, being on, like. Wi-Fi makes this a lot more difficult for me because there's so much information I'm used to having, used to have that I don't have. Mhm. Mm no, and that's one of the biggest things from coming over from Showdown. And it's completely fair, by the way. Ah, yes. <laughs> we found it out. It was life I just wasn't paying attention. Okay. I mean, that's too. Oh wait, yeah, the layout. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm bad. It is protect. It showed protect. Yeah. It showed protect already. We lose the Asparta like this. It's protect three attacks. Okay. This kind of screams choice scarf to me. T U. Um, I'm gonna assume choice scarf here. Man, and now that you tear it, you simply do not have a switch in. Against our roaring moon. Yeah, we died to an overheat 100% of the time. Oh, jeez. I mean, you sack muds here, right? I really do want to get rocks up, but I'm sacking it. There's no dark resist anymore either, besides the slither. Which isn't the most reliable one, right? Yeah, see, Terra, I get to see what he turns into. Um, is, is it fire or fair? No, I think it's your play, though, too. Because, like, I feel like a spot, or I feel like, uh, a spot or broke up. Broke open a big enough hole to where you didn't need it anymore. I don't think that's that bad. I think you. I think it did exactly what it was supposed to do in the game. Oh, is this gonna bait in the lichen rock? You get the DD off, get the charty to pop, and then win. That would be crazy. Because Sep is in such a good position right now. Mhm. Mm this could be a winning play because we have the charty back from lichen rock. Yeah. And you eat it. Yeah, he, he, he roost he all over the other dude? Oh, dude. Yeah, Fortnite. This, this, this is the scenario I envisioned in my head multiple times. Those you roost here on the U-turn. Body press, that's annoying. We still have Rotom and Iron Moth around, so we can definitely, we can definitely deal with it. I'm gonna quickly, but just because I don't remember everything about them. Um... I feel like you for sure U-turn. I, I mean, about, roost, right? Get, like, a facing move, right? I'm pretty, pretty confident. I'm just gonna I feel like you for sure roost. No, we, we have, we, we have way too bulky of the, um... Also, he's pressure, which is a little bit annoying. Oh, Brave Bird's a little scary. But, I mean, you roost on the Brave Bird in the next turn. I think this is a wrap. I think this is a wrap. You got the two DDs. This guy's gonna come in. He's gonna sell rock. I mean, I wonder if, like, Bandit actually gives him I know Blackness was talking about Bandit earlier. I think we have a Terra Sweep. Big, big set. Great Brad. No, no, Bandit or Life did not kill. Oh, yeah, Sponge. 
annoying. I forgot it was Sash too. Huge. Do I preserve? I want to preserve. I think you have to preserve this. This is your way of winning, dude. This is your way of winning. Not the Chinese berry. Does he guarantee kills you? I'm at eighty. Yeah, no, he one hundred percent kills you. Mm-hmm. You have to save this. I'm gonna like him set. Oh god. Slithering. Um. No, actually, Stone does a lot of slithering. Man, the rocks. I should have. Mm -hmm, I should have prioritized rocks. And Hold on, I think. I think. It wasn't with the sash. See, yeah, accelerates into Stone Age hurts a lot. Yeah. I'm gonna preserve uh, our wrong moon because I do think it plays a decent role here. Yeah. No, I think this is definitely the play. This is for sure the play. Is he adamant with the damage he's doing? He we slithering. We went down to one sixteen. Excelrock did. We are at sixty five. Excelrock did like yeah. Let's no, see. He's adamant. He's adamant. He can actually kill with a stone at you. That's fast. That's actually really bad. He does that. Um, yeah, he can. Yeah. Wait, this thing's going crazy right now. Because if you don't first impression, you die to the stone edge, you're giving another Pokemon up. Oh, good you turn Good you turn He got him out. I mean, he has to save this, though. Yeah. No. I don't think Dual Wing Beat was the play. I think you go into Moon and you click Acro. No. no you're fine, dude. I think that U turn was a great play. I think that U turn was fine. Oh, man. This has been a great game so far. I love it. I could have roosted, I guess. Yeah, wait, I should have roosted. I'm stupid. I should have just roosted. I mean, we, get, we killed the Annihilate, right? Which is fine, but he goes into Lightning Rock. And okay. I'll, well, I have to sack him on, I think. Oh, Del wants me to drag him. Uh, okay, Annihilate is dead. Hi, Del. And, okay, this is actually a Okay. Let me like, share my screen. You, you, you can also uh, add some nice. commentary if you'd like, this but you don't need to. No way it's not, right? Alright. No way it's not, uh, I mean, it, oh, dude, this thing's so scary. And when he Terra Fires now, too, like... I'm pretty sure he could just lock Flamethrower, right? What do you sack? Do you... Ah, uh, I don't know. I feel like you want to keep that first impression in the back. I feel like you really, really want to go Moth and sack it off. If he Dark Pulses, so what? You can go in and, you know, threaten it out with Slither, get a U-turn off. Oh, no! Oh, no! He overheated! Is this Bye, Dad. Now, what is... No, my friend. <laughs> they burn my friend. Yeah, with fucking overheat. Oh, no. I need to preserve either Iron Moth or Rotom. Oh, the moon could have won. We see an overheat. Can Rotom revenge now? Um, it can. He's Scarf. Confirm Scarf, though. Mm. So Moth gives him the best positioning because he just clicks. Um, he just clicks fire move. Moth does seem better than Rotom. I agree. Because Moth is now. Yep. Volt also covers the same thing. But this is gonna do so much at minus two still. Yeah. This is gonna do so much to this thing, and this thing can live a Lycan rocket from here. Okay, it's gonna be at like sixty-seven HP after it takes this overheat. Is that what we're calling? That's soul read on the calc. That's my uh, head calc. Yep. Never wrong. Man, the sash saved him. Like it's well planned because he also, you know, did the whole haunting our. He also had a really good removal under your team. I mean, first impression still does 59 to 70, so we do quite a lot of damage, actually, even to a fire Yes, he withdraws back to Lycanroc, is what I'm assuming. Mm. If you go... Oh, he's preserving Lycanroc, so he can deal with the... Uh, oh, this is gonna be yeah. good. Yeah, because he sacks, he, he sacks Lycanroc, then he wow. loses. That's I, I don't think I have a reason not to go Lycanroc here, right? Oh, no, don't miss, don't uh, miss, don't miss. Oh. Don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Don't miss, don't miss. I mean, he's keeping the Lycanroc because it beats, um... What do you call it? Iron Moth. Mm, the only thing that stops it. Oh, yeah. hit. Okay. Huge. Huge. Oh man, this thing's. We're not scarf moth. Oh no no no. No 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 no. No, this kills. Oh my god, it lived. Lives. Holy. I did not think it was gonna live. I thought it was gonna die. I guess I don't know the counts, dude. I thought it was gonna die. I said, no, 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 we're throwing. We're throwing, we're throwing, we're throwing. <laughs> Fun fact, Gentleman Thomas, Tottenham Spurs fan, also my favorite soccer team. Good shit. There we go. I mean, you just attack here. Fire Blast. That's a scary move to lock into. That is not overheat. <laughs> oh, no. So I think you'll Rotom, and I think you Volt Switch. 
Rotom Volt Switch, right? Does Rotom Volt Switch put it in range of, um, what do you call it is the question? First impression, because you're banded. It Dude, I thought it killed too, friend. I what really thought it killed. Mm. It was a roll. Dude, that didn't even look like a roll. He was at like 20 HP. I was at like 20 HP. Because he hits the fire blast, that's annoying. Ow! Get a burn as well. It doesn't matter. Oh, thank you. Hit. Okay. Oh! I needed to know if Volt Switch put him in range. What was he at? <laughs> Okay, I was so nervous with this battle, but murder just never amount to anything. Let's go. Come, come a little. Oh, Who's he at? 100. Okay. Let's say. Blindness He's only 4 is HP. is all it takes. Falling in love with me. Oh, he got the burn. Not that it really matters, but. Mm -hmm. You did get the burn. Yeah, I was going to say, it didn't look like a roll in the moth. Um, hold on. I want to see. What was your Rotom spread again? You were pretty offensive, right? So, 164 okay. modest. I'm curious. I want to look at this guy. That was so scary. That was so scary. Okay. Volt switch at level 50 into Chiyuski. We're calculating mineral into mineral. Oh, that's not level 50. I was like, it shouldn't do 9%. So just 35. So 35 minus 100 is 65 into... Oh, it's also Terra Fire. So we need to make sure we calc that against the Slither. So he's at 65. Choice band... Oh, no, I think you needed to pump. That does not do enough. Yeah, I think pump was your play, because, uh, I mean, I do think it is, like, severely in your favor. Like, as long as you don't get double min rolled, it's pretty severely in your favor. But, oh, my goodness, that was scary. Yeah, <laughs> that was... I'm both like having Caden. <laughs> no. We yeah. are bad, Sven. We're bad. I don't know what to tell you, okay? <laughs> we have two guys, and it is what it is. Are you guys, like, the angels of soccer? Essentially. <laughs> I mean, it's... Oh. Yeah, basically. Very good game, though, guys. Very good game. Do we want to watch Tones? All right, watch Tones. Let me see Tone. Tone Mm-hmm. So I think I saw half of this one. And oh. then... Yeah. And, uh, man. Banger. Good one. From what I remember. Okay, hold on. Where is... Where is my stream Yo. chat? Right. Shout out, Gentleman Thomas, Trick Ring Target Rotom. Yeah, he did. Did you join just a little bit late? You saw it? I, yeah. I'm, sharing, I'm sharing my screen right now, too, like, of the yeah. actual screen, so you can watch, like, live time with me. Yeah, I'm trying to watch same time as chat, too. Like, have chat open on my other, mm -hmm. other monitor. Yes, yes. I, I agree, Sep. It was probably... It, it was a really close game. And I think something, too, on Wi-Fi in particular, it is so much harder to see your end game because so many things are happening on your screen. And Tom's talking about it as a guy who just came over from Showdown. And I know you've mostly played Showdown 2 dashing. It is so hard to, like, keep all of these scenarios in your head and keep the information in your head from what's happened to the game already, what items are confirmed. You can't really confirm sets or roles or whatever it might be. So, like, it's tough. I mean, for sure, tough. Um, and you couldn't let it roast you out or lift in a solo. I don't know why Tone's cap card is 240p. <laughs> Damn, you asked me to play his game just to make fun of his cap yeah. card. What's up, Sven? He said, put on Tone. Bokeh <laughs> Okay. Let's see. Do I have... Oh, I just put Tone's video in here. Make sure, obviously, go check out Tone. Drop a like on the video, all that stuff. Oh, look at that. 43 views. Um, and then we also have to link Mr. T. Rowe, his opponent. Go check out Mr. T. Rowe. A guy with far too little subs for the amount of games he wins when he plays on Wi-Fi. Um... So go check T that T out. Tiro, very underrated battler. Like, extremely underrated. Oh, he's a very, very good player. And so is Toad. So this will be a good one. Um, Okay. I think it is time. Yeah, no, Sven, Ron. <laughs> Sven, do be wrong. He said, let's watch Toad. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> okay. Let me turn him up a little bit. He's a little quiet. Yeah, let's look. I don't think he's doing like... Oh, he did like a more in-depth team build. It was a really good video. Um, but we see weakness policy on the, um, what do you call it? The Espathra. Bances, which is really good here. Like, Bances is incredible here. Um, Scarf, uh, Meow. I guess that outpaces, like, plus one moon, which looks like it's a big, big threat to this team. So that makes sense. Um, as long as, like, because, like, plus one moon on a range of BP is a, a win, um, essentially. Um, Lefty's Gastro. I don't know if he's Fizz F or Spud F. Probably more Spud F to take, like, Mixed Grass Knot as well as, like, an E-Ball from this guy. I'm surprised no Rindo. Um, and then we have Balloon on our Slazzle, which that Pokemon does really well in general. Three choice items. 
Oh, we got all three, baby. Good catch. Go. Good catch. Good catch. Needed that one. Okay. We didn't get any bingo cards last game. Um, where we at? Uh, crit didn't. Did we have a crit that didn't matter last game? I actually do not remember. Um, we almost had a terror sweep. If the sash wasn't there. There's where another is... Ryan in D League pog. Oh, true. Offensive gastro would be quite good in this matchup. Offensive gastro does not have switch ins when it, if you look at the dual stabs, and it can take advantage of things like um, non CM hat um, and tink potentially like recover like stabs uh, sludge bomb as well, or you could even go ice beam. Um, but if you're not super would, like, worried be about the it, only only switch realistically mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. safely into it. Yeah, oh for sure. Did it keep sludge bomb? Did gastro keep sludge bomb? It does. Bomb? Yeah, because Kurt ran offensive yeah. gastro against Amo in uh, right, right, semifinals right. or whatever it was. Well, there you go. Um, we did the not. Oh, we did have not noticing item. We did have not noticing item. Nice. Nice. Okay. Cool. All right. We're gonna go. I know Tiro's team pretty well. I know he's a, he's imprisoned Hatterade with Shadow Ball, um, Calm Mind, Draining Kiss, uh, imprisoned. So it can't Shadow Ball him if he's like the Lumina Crash set. He's also Clear Amulet, I think, um, to not be Lumina Crash as well. So like really really good as spot uh, prep from Tiro because he got. Oh, don't buy it. He did not have a very good Spothler matchup. So, um, really, really cool set from him. That's two Spothlers in a row, too. Almost. He did not bring Don Fan. He... That was Don Fan. I mean, Don Fan kind of checked Scizor, but, like, also just got you turned on and, uh, something scary. Are there triple boots? Uh, on t -Rose side? I don't know. I don't think so. I got Jack. Let me pull up his team. I gotta find a server. There it is. <laughs> No, there's no boots. Oh, there's one boot. Um, let's go ahead and look at his team real quick, though. This is what we can see. Um, he is clear amulet on the Hatterade. Again, in prison. Really cool set. Um, life orb, just four attacks, physical. Palafin. He forgot to change the nature. I actually remember this. He was supposed to be adamant, but he forgot to change it off naughty. He was originally grass knot, but then CC did more. <laughs> so, because grass was so light. Um, he's Taunt, Covert, Cloak, and Eyelid, because Tone did have a Garganackle, um, so it covered that, which is awesome. And then he is Choice Scarf, Terra Dark, um, Roaring Moon, which is really good as well here. Uh, Helmet Tank to pivot into the Meow, and then he is Agility 3, Attacks 1, Con Moth. Um, definitely cool. Okay. Alright, so, how am I going to deal with... with Home Claws uh, will be pretty decent well, as soon as Tink is removed. Meowscar in general, once I mean, even Scarf is great uh, once Tink is removed. I brought Banded in my mock against T-Row because, again, once that Tink is removed, he does not appreciate switching into that Pokemon. Moon is one you turn away from getting blown up or player off away from getting blown up. Like, it's pretty tough. So this lead is free. I'm, I'm clicking Knock, personally. I think Knock is always the play in this instance because, like, yeah, Tink is coming in, but removing that thing's helmet so you can continue as a U-turn throughout the game is a little bit more valuable than grabbing that initial momentum because it's not like Tone doesn't switch into Tink a ton because nobody doesn't switch into Tink a ton, right? So I think <laughs> removing its item is a little bit nicer. Hey, man, things that are quad weak to steel don't switch into Tink a ton. You gotta... Yes, they do. <laughs> they sure do. Emon's terrible. There he is. Dog water Asmon. Poor Tinkaton. Yeah, so I think I would have knocked because it is helmet and like helmet's always T Rose bring into a team like this because you're gonna get knocked by this thing anyways. You might as well get chip or punish him for clicking U turn, you know? Um I really dislike leading Palaf in general. It's it's very telegraphed in a lot of games. And I think that's one of the reasons I've kind of strayed away from drafting it myself. Um, is I'm so scared to use it wrong. <laughs> because I feel like it's very particular in how you have to position it. And if you're putting yourself on the back foot immediately because your opponent's like, okay, they're going to lead the Pokemon that they have to switch out because they need to get that popped early. You can lose momentum so fast. So I definitely agree. Um, and again, I think Tone would have been an awesome spot if he just clicked knock off there and then like hard it out into this thing. Because I actually don't even know what the balloon is for. Uh, maybe this thing has bulldoze. It might have bulldoze. If he goes moth, I'm just going to go straight for the untoxic right afterwards. Well, that was very free. Uh, yep, he has my switch. Iron Moth should be coming in, I feel. Dark Ride. I don't want to be interested in bringing low mana. Oh, yeah, well... What I'm saying... Yeah, that's not like saying your lead's bad. It's just saying that, like... It can, having Palafin in a lead slot can, like, have... Give you bad momentum. And, like, have bad tempo in general. 
You're scared of using it. I can't use it. We're not the same. It's tough. It's crazy. I think this turns so weird because there's so many mods that are banned in smog right now that are not close to being broken in draft just because of how different the formats are this generation. It's super weird. Chiyu, Pow. Um, though I think Pow is debatably way broken. Um, but we'll see as time goes on. Um, Chiyu, Pow, Palafin, Houndstone especially, um, Espathra. Like there's so many monsters super broken in OU that are just so like they're very cheesy to an extent to where. In a counting format, they're just not as scary. You know what I mean? Mm, the speed of music, music is the speed of music for like that's that's the price we pay for watching them on one point seven five so we can get through a wall. That is the price Those we air pay. balloon for um in case you brought Dawnfin. That, yeah. that makes sense. Yeah. That makes sense. So yeah, then you don't really need it, so you might as well just go knock hard into Slazzle. In my mind. Welcome to chat, Tone. Oh yeah, toxic. Time. Toxic. Let's go. Corrosion. Corrosion. One of the coolest abilities that like never gets utilized because it's Kind of meh most of the oh, time. Oh man, there's one. Let's go. I mean, poison the poison type. I do think it's really cool that we have seen. It probably looks just like from Vault too. I do think that it's cool that we see another mom with Corrosion this gen and um Glamora. Now it's super overshadowed by Toxic Debris, but in draft in particular, dude, poisoning those Amoongus Corviknight cores is so nice. Those monkey at Terra, they're not broken at all. Yeah, and some of them aren't even broken with Terra. Hot take, I think Houndstone's dog water. I know, I know some, I remember, so in the draft stream. Specifically me, specifically me. In the draft stream and in Joey's stream where he was raiding all the teams, people were like, what the fuck, they got Houndstone in 12? Yeah, we do. That one sucks. I don't know. It's just, it's not good. I'm just not a fan of it in draft. It's not like terrible. It's not like not draftable, but I feel like it's aptly priced. Stone is really matchup dependent for what it's yeah. worth. Oh, for sure. Oh, this is a free Shadow Ball. Oh, 100%. Um, Moon, Moon is a very tough pivot into this thing, though. Moon is a very tough pivot into this thing. That's Imagine pretty nasty. Corrosion Blissey. Uh, I Yo, then we also have to give him Toxic. <laughs> yeah. Now, this is a, this is a big, this is a big to it, Gale. Oh my god, no it's not! He's broken! Dink is broken! That's Specs! Take it back, Owen. Take That's it back. <laughs> Take it back. Take it back. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, there was there was a lot of people losing their minds over a lot of things in both streams. Which, like, I get it to say, if you don't have experience in the format, you're obviously not going to know how different they are. But they're they're so much. I did a video like two years ago on why why your favorite Pokemon, why your favorite Smogon Pokemon sucks in Draft League, and like <laughs> I I don't know. It, it, they're they're so different, and there's monsters that are just like infinitely better in Draft than aren't as good in Smogon. You know, uh, like the Thundies are one in particular. Like they're like you know OU Pokemon, but they're not overwhelmingly used really outside of rain in past gens but like in draft they're incredible because they're so damn versatile or like torn goes from being like a top 10 mon to like the best mon in swish by far or dragapult is like the quintessential draft league pokemon that tone has right here in in ou it's great but it's it's not like the best pokemon of the tier i think pult with terra is leaves better than chien pao with para like it, it's crazy i don't know i think busted tink is na tink is nasty um Pow, Pow is something I think over the course of the generation we're going to start seeing it get more banned for. It is a Pokemon that legitimately feels unguardable. It, it legitimately just feels so broken. Big rocks. Good rocks here too. This thing is looking really scary. Oh, I just noticed he's banned SD in case he gets knocked by the tank. That's fire. <laughs> Wait, that's super sick. That's actually nasty prep. <laughs> That's nasty prep. Oh my god. Oh, Necrozma is a great, great example of that. Um, good pivot by Tiro to get that Rage Twist booster because he doesn't take much. Now, Bullet Punch would have done a lot, but you're also, you know, not getting too it KO'd. Already saying Ape is next in line. Yeah. Chen Pao Chen. after Flutter. It might be. I think Free Terra D Knight is more broken than Pal. Um, like, if you can carry Terra Dead I think D Knight is by far the best one in the format. Outside of Flutter being banned, but I think we're officially past that point where... No, I will say, though, there was one guy Enjoy in the chat... Enjoy yeah. using Valiant, that's all I say. I, dude, I feel like people are sleeping on that on, too, which is crazy. Um, But I, I don't know. I do think Pow is better. I think Pow is just so brain-dead broken. I think I think also Valiant has a little bit higher of a skill ceiling, whereas it's a little bit tougher to use. Um... I will say too in the in the stream, I noticed so many people were like, "Wow, I can't believe!" Or no, there wasn't so many people. There was one guy in particular. Like, I cannot believe they banned Flutter 
and are allowing XYZ Pokemon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> dude, for an hour. We did not entertain it at all either. I think the only one to say something was Dom, who was like, hey, man, different format. He wasn't even rude to him. For like an hour, he was like, these guys are idiots for banning Fluttermane. It was crazy. It was so funny. Okay. Any more house bears? Big wish. That's a good pivot by T-Row. Kind of recognizing like this thing offensively can't do much, and like Wisp is probably coming out here. But there's thing can swap around, but no Terra. Rolling power number one. Yeah, I think that's fair. Oh, your boy. Man, yeah, now Dex. Now Dex. I don't think it's as broken, and obviously things are gonna change as like the DLCs come out. I think even post home it's broken, but like when the DLCs come out, like obviously the Dex is gonna shake up a lot, and things are gonna change. So, oh. it's all preemptive stuff. And flamethrower just sacking this off. Big moth kale. <coughs> Big moth kale. We've seen no Terra yet. By the way, the wisp rides me. That's very. I get double stabs, but like you also ate up any sludge bomb or flamethrower coming for you, and covered a sub as well. So that's not that bad. I'll see. The big games come back, a lot of out-of-touch people are going to play. I mean, and that's how you grow the format. And obviously, you know, if we don't know these things, then, like, you know, you can't... I don't know, you can't rack on someone because they don't know these things. Oh, crit. Crit didn't matter. Wait. Okay, Tiro, were you two at KO'd from there? You were sacking, right? I need my crit didn't matter board, so I'm going to need you to tell me that the crit didn't matter. Because Tone acknowledged it as something that mattered. I don't think it did. It also could have Terra'd, too. Well, I'm going to say crit didn't matter, and we're getting our bingo board. I'm gonna say it. Crit did not matter. Let's go! I turned away chat too, so. I don't know if you need a low tier power check, then I'm better than Palian Taurus. Palian Taurus is good until you get clear amulet psychic fangs and fucking die. <laughs> um, yeah. Crit did not matter. Let's go! Switchblade comes out. This thing is really good to um, Tone's team. Fun fact, I don't think he's not smart for not bringing it because the Pokemon's terrible. I'm actually going to move it to two times so we can get through all these games. Um, his fairy type was a Daushpun. That was his check to Moon. So he had a, an abysmal Moon matchup. Real, real question for uh, for Mr. Tone. Is Switchblade the Scizor based on the wrestler? Because if it is, huge respect. If it's not, it's still a very good Bonk. Name. I mean, yeah, there's no, there's no Cartrusus. He doesn't want to take the chip, which is also fair. Because he lives one hit from Polt, even. Like, once you tear a Dark, you live a Spex Draco. Wow. Oh, that's a 2 at KO, though. Check did not check. Now, out in the Palafin. He does know it's banned now, as well. Based on the damage, which is why he made that pivot. Um, And this thing is going to click button. Button... Is he going to make the CC read here? Want to see it? Oh, big CC! Woo! No, that one didn't matter either. I think that two killed regardless. So we actually got a double did not matter. Do you think? Do you guys think that prediction equal KO for that one? It's a two at KO on the switch in because of the prediction and would not have otherwise. I feel like that's prediction equals KO. Uh, because crit didn't matter, he would have two killed regardless with two CCs. Yeah. I don't know, I feel like that might be it. Tone said it is, Tone calling it. Alright, there we yeah. go. That was, a, that was a good read by t -Row. Because like, if you take the bullet punch, you're not lowering your defenses for that anyways, you're gonna take it anyways, you kill the thing, and yeah. I think that's definitely fair. Okay. Imagine bulk up Palafin at this point. Um, yeah, that would, would kind of just win. It would? Uh, no, Meow. Meow yeah. lives from here. Meow lives from here. Well, let's just I, maybe bulk up life orb kills with jet punch right now. Um, I don't know though. Oh, no. oh we no, need no, someone to we need someone to bench the round one pick, and we have a bingo by the way. So okay, okay, I think I remember that. Do we? Oh yeah, we do. Great matter to allow me to ice punch yeah, for free. Yeah, okay, yeah. so that's a very niche, but the other one didn't matter as much. But a very niche interaction. You know what I mean? All right. Yeah. What is he? I mean, he, he can jet punch, but. Okay. Oh, jet Anybody jet have any requests for our next game? Good sack. Right, so goes down. Did not do much anymore. 
Um, and now where do you go? Is Tink still there? No, Tink is dead. And he, uh, no, Tink is at like 1 HP in the back. Ooh, I'm a mod. You sure are a mod, John Jr. What's up? Step on Gastron wins. I mean, maybe. It's not leftover, so I don't think it does. Um, yeah, this thing's scarfed to a flower chick. He's scarfing to this. Oh, he's not play rough, too. He's T-Punch. I wonder why he's T-Punch. I think of Tears Water. Finn. Finn? I mean, oh yeah, but like, flower trick. Is there a flying type? Hmm. I don't know t rose a Prater because Palafin did things. Alright, we'll watch, uh, watch a Prater Davion, right? I think I watched a little bit of that one. We'll watch that one next. Mod John's a mom, but I'm not. I'm so sorry, Antonio. Hold on. Oh, crit jet punch, let's go! Crit jet punch mattered. It mattered. Oh my goodness. Terra flying. That makes sense. Actually, no, you're right. You're right. Good middle ground. Wait, it's not letting me. It's not letting me mod you. What the hell, Ant? It's not letting me mod you. I'm looking right now. Let me know if I'm missing any bingos. Is this Terra flying over Terra? Yeah. No, that makes sense. That makes sense that you say that. Yeah, that was, oh, it didn't die. <laughs> How much does Jan Bandit Jet Punch do for Meow? I'd say probably like 45. Yeah, he's really good job keeping his, um... It's not like me, I just mod right now, and I'm sorry, Boski. You are no longer. Yeah. No, that makes sense, Tony. Because I'm too good. Yeah, they, they just know you're, you're above it. I I, um, I it was almost in range of Bandit Jet Punch. That's pretty crazy. I mean, it wins here soon. I mean, what it clicked? It clicked flower trick, right? So it's locked into that. Um, what do you call it? Typing that grass typing. You just crunch here. This is the freest terra crunch of all time. It's not terra spothra either, right? You just terra crunch. Draft league player, click U turn. Kill him with a crunch, please, please. Bingo. We're not at bingo. Are we at bingo? Rifle <laughs> player, click U turn. Tier's team is not okay. No, yeah, y'all messed up. I don't know what y'all did that for. <laughs> I'll be honest, I do not know what y'all did. I think like the bottom half of his team too would even like lack some kind of synergies and things like that. But like his his top like five are so broken. There's there's no out. There's no out. Oh, and he doesn't have protect. You just wave crash here, right? No. It goes down. I mean, he would have protected. Bingo. Broke my neck. Crunch didn't kill. He wasn't Protean. Okay, he wasn't Protean. Okay. Okay, okay. I thought he was Protean. I could have swore I thought Protean. Damn. Yo, you, this is what happens. You you just you just always assume. Damn it. I thought it's... I saw Protean. The uh, draft will drop the ball. Are you not? He, Derek, he said, I'm good. I wasn't in that pool. <laughs> Derek, he said it was them, not me. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I don't think I don't think we got any other ones other than the um, what do you call it? Crit didn't matter. I'm trying to think. No Terra sweep. Was there a double that we missed? Did Tira never Terra? No, they both Terra. Did Pult never Terra? Uh, oh. I haven't seen Terra Pult yet. Nope. It Pult didn't. No, no Terra Pult. Pult. Yeah, no Terra Pult. <clears throat> Did you? F oh yeah, dude. See, look at Septile. See, this is what I need you guys here for. Um. All right, let's see. Well, that and if they weren't here, you'd be streaming to nobody. But yeah. that is also true. <laughs> All right, let's go, Davion. Ooh. All right. There we go. We move back. Don't worry, guys. Don't ever tear. Oh, it's yep. a spot for Terra. Is it spot for Terra? <laughs> oh, I thought it was. Wait, dude, I literally mocked Hero for this game. It's I mocked Tiro for this game and I don't even remember. <laughs> I mocked Tiro. Um, Man, okay, it's all good. Tone and aim both with Terra Swathra. I hope they, they they can show that it's like it can be bumped up in points because I know a lot of people are. It's like it's like the most controversial thing to say is that a Swathra is better than what it is because it can Terra. Mm -hmm. But that's like, why I think I think it's fine with. Argument. I think it's fine with its Terra attacks right now, right? Because Terra with mm -hmm. Swathra without Terra is a twelve point Pokemon, and you cannot change my mind. It is not very good. 
this bother with Terra, I move it up to like that tier one 15 point ish mon. Great mox. <laughs> Free watch. I did watch a little bit of this one because I heard about it a little bit. I won't lie. I won't lie. But I am gonna uh, watch it. I'm gonna step out, I'm gonna step out for uh, just a couple minutes here. You're all good. You're all good. Um time to return. There we go. Please bring for death bulk up half of Finn. Hey, you mean. Um so what do we see? What do we see? What do we see? Um Goldengo go dumb stupid crazy on this team, by the way. He goes buck wild on this team. The ghost resist is our believer. Um, so it goes wild. Um, but as, as Lacanus mentioned, there is nothing for Palafin on this team. Other than the Vaporeon immunity, uh, there is, there is nothing for that Palafin on this team. So that thing looks really scary. Another Pokemon looks scary is I like the, the Life Orb, um, Valiant. As long as it's mixed, it does really well. Um, we see a Leftovers on our Houndstone with no sand, which tells me it's probably like a fluffy set, maybe aimed at checking something like a Baxcalibur. Um, I don't know what the Terra Captains are on these teams in particular, though. So if someone could let me know the Terra Captains, I'd appreciate it. Um, but yeah, this just kind of tough. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and link both coaches again real quick. Bam. You better believe in our believer. Maybe week two I will, Tiro. <laughs> Maybe week two I will. Um, and then where is a Prater? There he is. Go drop a sub to both these guys, obviously. Drop a like on their videos. All that stuff. It has to be Skeleturge. It, it should be on this team. Maybe Baxcalibur. Bax with Terra is a demon. Bax with Terra is a demon. He is so good. Um, what's up, Jaybear? Welcome to stream, buddy. Oh, crap. Welcome to stream. How does Fluffy counter backs? Yeah, uh, it can't get wisped. Um, it, you can still be like defensive fat body press sets and just take absolutely no damage. It doesn't counter it, but it checks it. And he's definitely Fluffy in a match like this. I mean, Knuckles also could take a little bit better hits from Finn. Um, and same thing from like Treads. Like defensive is not bad here at all. Our believe was actually a goaded mod. It looks okay, but it's not that normal typing on top of it. If it was pure grass, make it pure grass and make it grassy surge and I'll draft it. I don't like the dumb ability. I feel like the dumb ability is a waste. Because it's just worse grassy surge. And there's no grassy surge in the game right now. Minus Palafin, Dave has his Volcarona. Wait, no round one pick. Wait, what went round one? Damn it, what went round one? What went round one? What went round one? Was it, um... What's his name? Was it, uh... Volk, did Volk go around one? Make it faster? It's at two times speed, sir. I cannot make it go faster. It's as fast as it can go. Palafin? Damn it. No, 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 no. I mean, um, what was Davion's round one? Was it Valiant? It had to be Valiant, right? No way Valiant didn't went round two. No way Valiant went round two. But this could give us a big one. Valiant and Finn. Damn it. Um, damn it. Oh, dude, we almost had the round one. Damn it! No Volk is interesting. Volk one look at, looks like it went crazy with Terra. Oh, there's lots of frames dropping. He was... He was what item on his Orb Oliva? He went... He went what item on his Orb Oliva? Hello? <laughs> he had a... He had a life orb. <laughs> he, he had a life orb. He was bottom wheel, so did he get Valiant Volk? Back oh, if you would have just picked Volk first, type the message first, you would have gotten us a you would have gotten us a bingo. You would have gotten us a bingo. But no item now. So it was left over. It was, okay, that's fine. It was not left over, it was live orb. Um, it was Lorb! Life orb our believer. I find that psychotic. That's also crazy turn one switching. <laughs> he said you're knocking. Hold on, what do you leave with? Do you leave with Finn? Yeah, he led with Finn. That's crazy. Finn doesn't resist fighting. Valiant Gold. Oh, dude, you're round three, Volk? That's Demon. Okay, wait, I'm just zooming ahead too far. He says, sure. It's gonna be a Skeletor. I mean, that's, that's fine. That's fine. What are these? This is demonic. This is demonic. What? At least go into the Dirge and pretend like it takes two Shadow Balls. Pretend, at least. Oh my goodness, what in the world? Yes, it dies. 
Oh my gosh, Arbalibo is weak to fighting and so is Baxcalibur. He's also weak to fairy. <laughs> Not only was he life four Arbalibo and switched it into the Valiant, he then decided, he was like, I need to make a pivot on the fighting move in my fucking ice tight. <laughs> You're like trying to... Oh my goodness, that was psychotic. Okay, he gets a seed boost. Pinchurchin. Oh, Pinchurchin! This is the goat. Dude, Life Orb um, plus the uh, the core drive on the Valiant looks mwah, bellissimo, beautiful, wonderful, incredible. Ow. I did nothing. Spikes were cut. I don't know how I feel about spikes. In the sense that, like, I feel like right here, you might not even be able to clear right here because you're scared of the loot just setting up in your face. You probably always click Discharge here anyways. But, like, having some sort of water coverage... Doesn't this thing get Surf? I feel like he gets Surf. Yeah. He has to, right? This one's so bad. I know it gets Chilling Water, but that move sucks. I mean, a bit better than anything. He gets Pump, too. Um, Pump, Surf. Yeah, I feel like some kind of water coverage is much better than Spikes because the Spinner always beats the Hazard Setter. And that's a big thing, is making sure that you're not bringing Hazards that never stay up because... The removal option always beats them. And Treads is a really tough one, right? Treads spins so freely on so many Pokemon because of its typing. Um, same thing with Extra Drill before it. But I don't think Spikes is a great idea because it always, always, always spins them away. Always spins them away. Um, I suppose you can block that with Houndstone, but you're also one knock away from being useless and losing your leftovers. Um, so Spike Lee is bad, John. Spike Lee is terrible. Um, he's better this gen because Coco doesn't exist and Quark Drive Mons exist. Um, but I also think it's a double-edged sword in a team like this where it only has that one Mon. Yeah. I don't come to spinball so easy, but it gets knocked and then and next time it's two KO'd. <laughs> like, I don't know. I like it spin blocks it once or twice, but like it doesn't do it consistently. I don't know, and it's not very threatening offensively in this matchup right now. Life Orb, I believe, sits on Houndstone. <laughs> the guy like Aprater going into a going into his dirge on the last respects, and he's gonna put body press respect on the R believe a demon. He's gonna do oh, oh, oh that's a crit. Did you notice the crit? Oh, he didn't. Okay. Oh, yeah? that is an aggressive Palafin switching. Very aggressive. I'm surprised the Lucian didn't come in, being that it already popped up seed. Ting spikes are better. Yeah, no, I agree. Because Ting, Ting also doesn't get spun on by treads, too, is another thing. Ting does not get spun on by treads. You know? Interesting. It's not banded, so that's nice for me. Um, I'm just gonna. I can just this turn? Like, I. It not being a choice band is, like, huge for me. No way, man. Like, I'll do 17 to 21, but I'll see some Everybody hold candles up for day here. Uh, this is an issue. What if, okay, sorry, this sorry. poor fellow. Oh no. It's not leftovers. Wait, what item are you? Hello? We know Iron Valiant. Oh, Jet Punch, dude. I didn't think about Jet Punch. Ooh, that might be GG's. Hold on, I gotta think. I gotta think. It? Oh, yeah, Houndstone too. Yeah. Is this is Terra? Terra, give me my bingo. Terra, give me my bingo. Wait. This also might be 20 turns or less. How many turns have we had so far? Hold on, hold on, hold on. How many turns have we had so far? We're going to go through. So we had... One... Two... Three... Four... Five... Six... Seven... We're on turn eight right now. This is turn eight. Keep count. Doing these for main? No, um, Pokemon's gonna be watching through them for main. Um, so I'm doing D League. Punching glove, baby. That's true. Those drain punch keys about to do damage. Nine. This is nine, right? This is nine. So I'm gonna keep ca count for me. I don't know how to count. Oh my god. So we're at nine right now, right? We're at nine? Nine? Right. Why isn't he Terra yet? Isn't he Terra water? 
I'm just gonna Will-O-Wisp. You can't drink one. No, you can't Will-O-Wisp him! Yeah, we're fine. I'm so we're at 10. We're at 10. Talk, dude. This is such a good ring. Oh my gosh, I'm falling. I don't know what to do here. 10? He's gonna be bulking up. Should we test to see if he has what they called? Let's go bingo out speed. 10? Um, I know Terminator does. But Jet Punch! But Jet Punch! Okay. Hold on, I have like a small idea here. Like minimal. 10? We're at 10, right? Am I counting wrong? No, he doesn't bulk up here. Or we at 11. 10 or 11. I'm gonna say 10. We're, we're rounding down today. We're rounding down for the bingo board. I did jump in there. Okay. That was kind of my way out. I'm not gonna lie. 11. Um, so Jet Punch. So he's Jet Punch. I think I lose. I don't think there's a way out of this. Taunt is such an annoying. Why is this going like it's taunt? I didn't think the bulk up set was coming this week. And that's on me, dude. Can Gold Bango live a hit? Definitely not a oh, now we're at 11. Okay, we're at 11. We're at 11. We're at 11. We're at 11. Oh, we were at 11. Ten was not, so we're at 12. We're at 12. Okay, 12. 12, 12, 12. Sorry, I'm behind you guys. You said 11 right when that turn happened, so in my head I was like, okay, it's 11 now. I was counting right. I was not counting right. So we're at 12 right now. After this turn, it'll be 13. I definitely should have double checked. He has plus three. Okay, so I do have a chance to live the jet punch. Yeah, but you also don't kill. I'm not killing this thing. Unless you crit. I mean, this is the only thing. We're at 12 right now? Hold on, let me think my way out of Shocker, it. Owen doesn't know how to count. Shut up. It's going to be 17. I'm forced to go Houndstone. Doesn't matter as long as we're below 20. I don't care. Sub 20, 20, 20, 20. Come on, baby. Wait, is this also going to be a 5 0 loss or greater? <gasps> we might get big off this game. It happens. Okay, well, it shouldn't be banned anyways, but I mean, you just got a little bit out prepped. Um, maybe we should run a little, something a little different. I don't know. I, the matchup might have been abysmal, um, <laughs> but we don't ban Finn. <laughs> well, it was, it was a good set in the matchup. This is always a set that he brings. I don't think it's a bad set that he brought, like, or it was like a cheesy set, you know? Um, I think that Davion was obviously under prayer prayer for it, and it got out of hand so fast because... Yeah, uh, can can I get some copium in the fucking chat? Um, but yeah, I, I mean this is the best set against him for sure. You can't drink me. Ow! I just do it again. And a jet punch. He got a crit. Wait, that wasn't a crit. Help! What did I run wrong? What did I run wrong? Paladin hero. I know he didn't know it, but I'm saying the cope is the is the well, banned for a fucking reason. Why do we allow this? <laughs> it's, a, it's a little much. So much. He knows now, though. He does know now. That's a little bit much. No, he did. He meant it should be banned because he said something about it after the game in the chat too. Uh, yeah. I didn't see this thing get did we get twenty? Did we get twenty? Did we get twenty? Did we get twenty? <laughs> it's loud because it's a GG. It is what it is, dude. I'm not. Yeah, this is a rough matchup, and we said it from in the when we were building. We said it was gonna be a tough matchup. Uh, bulk up. I don't know what else to do besides haze. Uh, but you brought taunt, so I couldn't. I, I, there's no way I could have played around that. Um, I don't know. I don't think there's anything else I could have done better in prep. Ooh. So, good play on the on what's it called. If I would have stayed and clicked that uh, move there, yep. better situation. But there's nothing I can do. I don't think there's a Pokemon on. Wow. That could have helped me in this area. It might have been that. That might have been the case. That might have been the case. 100. Like, um. There, so. But it's not a manable Pokemon. It, it is. It is quite simply not. And uh, maybe maybe you could you could argue Terra. Um, <laughs> I D-Ray. I think we just got I think we just got Bingo. Was that five zero? I'm not worried. At the end of the day, it's just a rough matchup. Shit happens. We go. We move on to the next round. Five zero. That sucks. Got the Bingo baby. We got the Bingo baby. Let's go. Let's go. Hold on. Gotta get the Bingo going. Control C. Control V. Five zero loss or greater. We got so many from that one. Twenty turns or less. Terra sweep, dude. We might, we might completely block out the board, dude. All right, what are we watching next? What are we watching next, chat? We got the bingo though. Let's go, bingo. Um, okay. Let's see. Less than twenty, baby. Let's go. Nineteen points. All right, all right. Nineteen turns. All right, what are we watching next? What are we watching next? Um. Who have we not watched? We've not watched a game that Rolo, Sosa, QSN, Corkin have participated in. Neither Wreck It Mike. We watched Thomas, T Road, A Prayer, J Ricky Tone. We haven't watched Razor Claw. I like Razor Claw. Let's watch Razor Claw's video. He got some cool stuff. Where's he at? 
There's, I can't tell which one's, oh, it's this one. It has BBR on the logo. Okay. What's up, guys? Praise the Lord. Wreck-It Mike? Oh, I just heard Wreck-It Mike. All right, we're going to do this one after. We'll watch Wreck-It Mike. Where is Wreck-It Mike? Or is this against? I mean, this also might be against, uh, no, this is Wreck-It Mike versus Smallville's, Smallville Smallives. I don't know who that is. Who is he? Is that Corkin or Rolo? I know it's one of those two guys. I know it's one of those two guys. I'm excited to see the heat, though. I don't know what the heat was. I don't know what the heat was. All right. Here is Wreck-It Mike's. Again, go check him out. Drop a sub to the channel. I haven't done so already. What am I doing? I haven't subbed to all the D-League coaches yet. So there's a sub. There's a like. Uh, and then where is... Who did we play? Corkin. All right. Corkin. I don't think I've even subbed yet to Corkin, so I'll do that as well. Bam. 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 Don't be stingy with your subs, too. Roll over to Titans. Well, I haven't done that either. No, he's not. See? Dude, I don't even know. Play him Okay. We should be good now. Okay, I think we got everyone. Yeah, go check out his, too. So PBA. Oh, he's in PBA, too. That's cool. Can Rotom hide? Can I run? Oh, no. He has a Rotom, right? Wait, who has the Rotom? Wait. Rotom can hide? Wait, which, which, ro oh, there's a Rotom heat. I just can't see him. What? Okay. So we'll look. Um, Terrapult, is it, if it's Terrafire, it does really well here, potentially. Um, what kind of, ah, actually, between King Gamma and Claude's Iron, it's pretty tough for it. Um, it's going to U-turn around forever, though, and be annoying. And, and, uh, Amugus. But I think you bring Terrafire here if it is Terrafire, which I feel like it should be. I don't know what Rolo's Terra is. I don't know what Rolo's Terra is. Um, we see Meow Scarada, Scizor. Meow does pretty okay, actually. Sets up a lot of spikes and U-turns around everywhere. Um, the bundle looks almost unguardable. Uh, I guess you go, like, AV Sloking and hope it's not Specs and, like, hope it doesn't click the right button. Um, though between, like, Rotom plus Sloking, it could be okay, but even Rotom gets worn down by Specs Freeze Dry. Same thing with Scizor. Oh, no. It's actually a really tough bundle matchup. Bundle looks pretty nasty. Yeah, let's look. We do see Terrifier. He's banded. Bandit it makes sense. That's yeah, not that bad. If you can catch the, uh, the Gambit with an attack, Fandle Force is a little scary, though. Because that gambit gonna come in, he gonna click a button. I don't know if you ever click that. Maybe sleep talk would have been better. Um, to have a sleep absorber. Um, we see focus ash. Are we corrosion? We are not. So he's rocks, earth power, power gem, and mortal spin. Which is interesting into the Amoongus. Maybe a corrosion set or maybe like spiking in his face would have been worth. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I want to see what the heat of the week is. We see scarf. You turn low kick, knock off flower trick. Makes sense. Leftovers, Bullet Punch, Sleep Talk, U-Turn, Rest. This is cool. I actually have not seen a lot of Rest Sleep Talks. I have not seen a lot of Rest Sleep Talks. Um, Kilo, Kilo is just Terra Flying Slash Ice. Oh, Kilowattrel? Okay, Owen, do you still think Parrot should be banned on Pult? It probably should be in objectively, like, not content leaks, for sure. Um, I think that we are very liberal with allowing things here. We only banned... Flutter. It's the only thing we banned. Um, in the showdown space and like more competitive places that I've seen, it's is pretty universally banned in ninety percent of places. <laughs> um, it is pretty universally banned, and I think it should be. Um, there's a Morgram. There is a Morgram on the screen. Hold on, I'm just trying to find sub dish. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! The Clodsire! He's gonna get subbed on! He's gonna get fucking stored powered! Wait, that's super nasty! Wait, that's so sick! And the stored power covers the Amoongus too, which you can sub all over? Dude, I love it. That is super sick. That is super sick nasty. He's not Terra Bundle. Can somebody get him to be Terra Bundle, please? Um, did he change that yet? That's super sick! And then he's dual screens on this thing. Um, Eviolite though, so the screens aren't gonna be there very long. Low kick parting shot. I mean, it's, the priority parting shot is also really nice. He is hard rain. Glim gets corrosion. Glim does get corrosion. Yep. <laughs> there you go. I got. I got some stuff for you. Week three. I think you're in week three right now. I got some. I got some tech for you. Week three. <laughs> it does indeed get corrosion. 
better for me. Um, so yeah, good luck on my opponent. Actually, let me see. Got two things. There is a more grim on the screen. I want to see turn one KO. Let me give you a turn one KO or a double. There's so many ways we can get triple bingo or like. All right, so he starts with the white roll. Quintuple bingo. Okay. Uh, we right, leave this. Power jam base. This is just gonna follow switch though. So I'm just gonna rock. If he doesn't. Yeah, it's always gonna get out. Like I said, he was just. Oh my goodness! Holy specs. Yeah. yeah. Because I didn't bring immunity or ground type. That makes sense. Uh, Does he not have a ground type? Or didn't bring one? What's the ground type? I'm gonna come back. We're at 1345. Oh, it's Santa Condo, which isn't coming here. That's fair. Uh -huh. That's fair. If my mate sucker punch me, then that's fine. If he tries to source dance, I will air power. Heck out of you. Yeah, you wanna get this chip. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Counter cleave. Oh, and you get the corrosion up. Did the Amoongus come? So Amoongus did come, but like, you want to go into something, I don't know if you want to go into this, because you want to go into something that forces Amoongus to not come in. I think if you're going to tear your Pult, I think going Terra Pult and Terra Blasting here, because you either pick this off, you live a Sucker Punch, and then if he goes Amoongus, you 2-it KO it, like your choice man. You do a ridiculous amount of damage. I think that that's your best play, probably. Um, or going into Rotom, because Rotom also doesn't force it in, but I don't think you kill with Discharge from here. You know? Uh, Santa Con doesn't count as a ground, unfortunately. Don't tell that to John. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if John's still here. Don't tell that to John. He might get upset. <laughs> I agree, though. That one's pretty bad. That one is pretty uh, damn bad. Uh, I will think a U-turn will kill it from where he is. Let me stab you turn of that. But I don't oh, know. I guess stab you. The only thing is, like, ah, uh, T-Spike's not going to get any value, unfortunately. Yeah, so. the claw he goes into the Among Us. Oh, there's also a Claw Dire. Yeah, yeah, Same yeah. thing. Claude Amoongus is demon. What a core. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's why I think maybe the Terrifier might have been worth. Cool. Um, because um, it, it prevented this. Cool. I guess the Claude could have also come in, though. But this is this is where we go to town. This is super sick. Yeah, it's to the John is Santa Conda. Also, shout out to the Elite Warrior. Another benefit of playing online competitions, I guess, is not having to do that. Doesn't need to be dragged. He's coming back. Back on anymore. You're back just in time, Mr. Dell. Hey. You're back just in time for some demon shit. Oh boy. What am I? Hold up. Hold up. Let me. Anaconda is not the better than Mudsdale, you crackhead. Uh, Everybody yell at John in the chat. John did in chat. Everybody yell at John in the chat for saying Anaconda is better than Mudsdale. Everybody boo this man. Boo. Oh. Ooh, sub? Tomato. Nasty? Sub? Nasty? Oh, he got up the rocks. No. healing. Not my boy. Uh, just gonna try to get plus six. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. Can he not touch it? Can he not touch it? He Poison jab, does it break sub? Does it break sub? Yeah, so the team, team Santa, uh, let's do, uh, let's do teams, all right? These are the dodgeball teams at recess. We have Team Mudsdale and Team Santa Conda. Team Mudsdale is every person, and Team Santa Conda is John Jr. and Grandmaster D-Ray. I'm picking the other- I'm picking Team Mudsdale to win, I'll be honest. <laughs> I'm picking Team Mudsdale. I am a plus two, yes. I'm gonna go ahead and the flies in this game? I think it does if the mod flies. <laughs> Wait, actually? Yeah, look, it's floating. Makes sense, makes sense. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> look, another free sub. Get up the sub, baby. I haven't seen that. All right. so this is, kind is this just all mods? Right. Yeah, just sub again. Uh, sub again. Oh, this is so free. Oh my goodness, this is nasty. He sub nasty plot stored power for the Claude Zara Mungus. Okay. I gotta say, Claude has the coolest attack animation with its little like spiky things oh, yeah. coming out of its back. I love that thing. Oh my god, that actually did not do as much as I wanted it to do. This is Deli Bird versus Glalie all over again. Yeah, but Glalie's the objective <laughs> best choice. Just like fucking Muzdil. So you're right, this is the same thing. <laughs> do you and I have a fighting chance? No. I say it's a 45-55 in our favor. In our favor. My entire chat, plus 90% of the Pokemon community, against you and Daniel playing dodgeball. You could even have a Santa Conda plushie on your team. That's it. If he's not sucker though, that's fine. you just discharge and kill him. He's plus six right now. This is demon. What does he do? Oh, this is such a good set. This is a great bring. Good. Yeah. Wrench and and volleyball emoji. You guys are gonna do great. Don't worry, Dray. Dude, didn't you play like the D line or like a linebacker position? I know you can't catch and throw shit. We're fine. 
Fun schools? Oh, we get the chip. Dude, this could just do this later. Okay. Cool. So you're gonna get your heckin' kick. Okay, we get the fleshy we clean, no chance. So true. Oh my god, what a check. That's specs as hell. You almost want to get hit here, by the way. So that you can get, um, what do you call it? 3 KO and get a free switch into something else. If you switch, I will love it if you switch. He appears they find a way, probably. I don't know if it's worth to be this fire week one. Nah, it was worth this week to be this fire week one. It is for sure. We 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 just secure wins. You got eight weeks to make. You got, no, they actually only have seven weeks to make playoffs. They have seven weeks to make playoffs. You're winning every game you can, no matter the heat. So we're gonna go ahead and say it's the screen. Um, I don't want to give me a competitive boost. He has to cover for the thunder wave too, which makes sense actually. It's booster bingo yourself. No. No! <laughs> and we already got the square. We already got the square. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. I'm just gonna go for Loki just for the just for damage, I guess. It's gonna Terra. So you're gonna lose the electric type. So you yeah, you're gonna lose your electric. It's gonna keep fewer flying. He can probably kill me right now, Slash now, which is unfortunate. Yeah, we gotta get Wreck it, um, Mike a uh, YouTube okay. icon. Terra blast too. Oh wait, so Loki's fine though. He gets a little bit of chip and you get the reflect up and you die. Are you changing the board every week? Yes. I'm, I'm going to ask people to give me suggestions, though, because it's very hard to come up with good questions for draft like bingo. That will actually happen. This is yeah. cool. I mean, I haven't seen Terra kill a Lotril. Like, yeah, that's, but that's he has a, a very, bundle. Like... He has a bundle. Terra the bundle. I don't know, man. Flying moves are just so spammable this gen. Yeah, so is a fucking uh, ice plus water stab. Bonk, yeah. bonk. And the Gambit's yeah, dead. The first one. Oh, Gambit's dead. This is just like, this just like cleans. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this just cleans. What the fuck is this oven? Heat. That is the answer. That is literally Rotom Heat. Oh, and he's Rest Talks SR too, yeah. Yo, Wreck It Mike, you have my heart. Oh my god. <laughs> I love wrestling nicknames. If, if, oh, just top tier. Oh, you didn't know? Terra Blast, not miss. I mean, it's stronger than Air Slash. So, like, Hurricane plus Terra Blast isn't the worst thing. If you have both. The badass Billy Gun. Yeah. He's in. Alright. We have to go ahead and get in here. Yeah, but you're faster. I'm sporing. He's gonna take the damage, which is fine. Uh, but they just sent us else Guy like me just stay in and spam and bullet punch. So, we got Selena. Uh, we're gonna score. Yeah, we're gonna score. Uh, I'm a big fan of knocking off here, but I could also just U-turn. Alright. Let's see. This thing's still somewhat valuable, so I'm gonna U-turn. He's gonna withdraw, fantastic. Interesting. Okay. Interesting! Por que? Have the that would Terra Blast bottom means no Hydro Cries. Yeah, that's that's another thing too. Yeah, you can Terra Blast with, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, but we hit Hydros. We, we do hit, hit Hydros, hydros in, here. This house. in this household, we hit Hydros. Well, I'm gonna draft a bundle if I'm not hitting Hydros. That seems like a stupid thing to draft if you're not hitting Hydros, I'll be honest. I couldn't miss Hydro. Feels like a skill diff. Honestly. Simply... <laughs> not me. Yeah. That might be you, but not me, D-Ray. I don't miss Hydros. I miss Leaf Storms. Repeatedly, but... <laughs> not Hydros. Not Hydros. Oh, and I swear to God, if you ever try to speak Spanish again... Even if it's one yeah, word. Por qué? Por qué? I wasn't speaking Spanish. It was there was Spanish involved. Oh man. Yeah. As a bundle owner, I will not miss a single There you go. Next square is, um, next square is what you say is a guy like me. His he play. That is a good guy like me. He all just cursed himself. Hey, he didn't drop bundle. He's good. Talk all the shit I want. This kills, I think. I go for it. I think he has to regen out. He might just be trying to recover health with the generator going in. Yeah, I think he has to regen out again. But even then, like, this is an Oko. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so he's just pivoting around. He's gonna get bundle. Dude, that, uh, that what do you call it gave just so much value. Yeah, Bonk. Bonk, dude, pulls the demon. Yeah. There's no fairy, right? Was there a fairy in the matchup? Yes, sir. He's broken. Mostly because we do have a switch to four. Uh, we kind of just go back into the gun. Yes. You can also sub on this thing, too, with your Rotom again. You can find the opportunity and get the position, too. Rocks are up, though, so actually... That's fine. Ow! Just rest. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and rest. 
What's the last mon? What's the last mon? It's Moongus plus Hattering? Oh, yeah. This thing goes crazy right now. Uh, your only two Pokemon left are Pelipper and this, right? Yeah. Alright, uh, so then Sleep Dog. Or Pelipper's there? Pelipper! Pelipper! Oh Wait, Sleep Talk has a sick animation this gen. Wait, that has a sick animation. Hatterene. Because Pelipper, it doesn't really matter, does it? Silly, Silly old, no no fairies in That's so true. And Hatterene also gets blown up by like fucking banded U turns. It's just like 30. And then you die of dragon darts. Rings gone. Honestly, the update made uh, the textures so nice for everything. Oh yeah, the steel types in particular look. Gosh, yeah, nice. it, they look so shiny. Let's see the U-turn. Uh, but this is okay. Also, Pelipper looks so sharp. <laughs> he, he has a very yes. pointy head now. He does. Like, it's the the I think it's just the shadows. Like, so... I think the yeah. shadows are a little bit more, you know, <laughs> pronounced. Yeah. Wait, Hurricane has a cool animation too. Yeah. I have not seen Hurricane yet. I Wait, that like was they, sick. I feel like they changed Ooh. some of them. Yeah, oh, they... Like, in the update? Yeah, I feel like they had to have, like, made them cleaner. Because I haven't seen maybe. Hurricane look... Maybe it's the background that makes it look nicer. That's also a... No, I think you go pull. Yeah, you go pull, bro. <laughs> Dragon resist Amoongus. <laughs> you, you go pull. So, let's go for the darts. Switch it to Amoongus, I'll, I'll be happy to see that. Oh yeah, he switches to Moongus, he loses. This, 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 this is checkmate. Oh! Shiny. Yeah, obviously. Ooh, shiny. Yeah, Dude, I have the attention span of a five-year-old. You put shiny, like, bright objects in front of me, I'm I'm all here for it. Yeah, I guess we just Terra is, like, one of my favorite things to look at. I'm like, wow. Yeah, look at that, it sparkled and everything. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's very close. I think that is, that is it, right? I mean, did Corkin did right, well, round one, sorry, right? Uh, he had, a I mean, he has bundle? So it was just a good clean game. Um, deal with a Terra Pelter, which will be uh, sorry, Armada, which will be terrifying. Uh, but other than uh, the um, pole, yeah, wouldn't it? Yeah, and bundle. Okay, yeah. yeah. So we didn't we didn't get any there. Do we have any any of these? No turn one KO. No turn one. No double. No three plus heavy duty boots. What are you guys not running boots for? It's crazy. Wait, I'm sorry. Who let Mike have that team or like the first like five? Dude, there's some Just... there's some even more crazy ones. Like this is an amazing start, but this seems so much more obtainable than something like T-Rose team. Which is like... You say Polt answer, like that's an actual thing. With how much coverage that thing gets. Polt answer was probably like bulkier Gambit plus Rain. Um, but yes, Polt answer was not in attendance. He didn't really have one though. To be fair. Like a Moongus, maybe. But like that's... <laughs> no, Bandit was a good bring too. Yeah. Who would have known Dragapult is pretty strong. He is pretty strong. That was a really cool Rotom set, though. That, that really broke open the hole, too. I didn't tear, but... Oh, true. No. Okay. Um, And then, who we were gonna watch Razor Claw, so we'll do that one next. I don't think we've done... Yo, Mike, can we can we get you a, can we get you a YouTube icon? <laughs> we gotta oh, plug them up. What, uh, what's the favorite one? Your Victinis, right? Yeah. What's Victinis. your favorite? What's your favorite Pokemon? We gotta, we gotta get you something nice. Something crisp. You go. You gonna be battling like that? You gotta, you gotta have a nice, nice little YouTube icon. Cause here's goddamn. Razor, and it looks like he's playing King Sosa, who I, I didn't. Hold. Yeah, I'll take donations. Bet. I'm. I'm looking. And my screen, I saw a comment. And. Yeah, Pickles, I agree. No, it's not Swalot. It's the Specs in Race. On my screen. Wait, I love that. What? That's so what does it, it do? <laughs> He's got little glasses on. <laughs> What does it do? He glasses on. <laughs> I don't care if he's wearing glasses. No, man, he's stunting. What do you mean? Cinderace, Cinderace out here blocking out the haters. You mean? I, I quite simply do not understand. I'll drop Sosis as well. Definitely drop him a sub. Um, oop, that's a poll. I, I, I want to know what it's for. Somebody, please tell me what it's for. What does Mike have on Dude, the? Dude, What does what 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 you... Sosa have on the bench? I want to know what it is. He does have a tattoo gear in Swalot. He cooking. <laughs> Swalot hard. Why is the Rex in there? Swalot hard guy, dude. Oh, that's Shadow Ball for Dirge? No way. Actually, hold on. I have Cinderace in another league. Let me go real quick into the move pool here. 
It does indeed get Shadow Ball. How much is uh, Shadow Ball Pro you doing? <laughs> okay, I got you. Hold on. We'll, I feel we'll like you might belt. be able to go Expert Belt or like this Life Orb. Math, math it doesn't Oko. I know that for a fact. This thing is like two spadet or two special decks. It's not meant to Oko. Last time you brought Banded, he's AV Palisand, Weakness Policy Vaporeon. I have the utmost respect for Spec Cinders. I'm calling the police. <laughs> Um, I think I'm just gonna hate I mean, okay, Shadow Ball 2, Skelly Dirt. Oh, look, he's at the beach! That's where I played my game today. I was at the beach, too. Yo, go to the beach! The two beach. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Hold up, hold up. Specs, Cinderace, Timid, two hit KOs, max HP, max Spadef, Calm, Skelly Okay, can you do that with a life orb? Can you do that with a life orb? Uh, no? Um, let me look. Life Orb it, makes it a roll. Nope. God tier bring. I love that. Top tier. It just clicked Life over here. Alright, hold on. Hold on. We're doing a poll. We're doing a poll. How much do we think Specs <laughs> Overheat is doing to Small Eye? It just clicked it. I haven't seen it yet. Let's, 33%. Uh, how do I poll again? Damn it. Low tier team versus Iron Valiant. <laughs> Where is poll? Engage with your audience. Alright, audience, it's time to be engaged. <laughs> Call the fuzz. Arrest this man. <laughs> Last I played Razor Claw, he brought Banded Jellicent. Yo. That is. That is a set. Specs Ace, AV, so like 30, 40%, 40%. Alright, look in look chat, guys. Real mm -hmm. quick. No, do not talk about it out loud. I'm not going to talk or about actually, it. Actually, don't look at it. Vote in the poll. Tell me. Asking my community. Let's see. How much do we think it's doing? 40%? 50%? 60%? Or, I don't care, call the police. Oh my god, wait. We have one. Uh, we have 40% and we also have people who want to call the police. <laughs> uh, I have a, we have a, it's specs. I feel like it has to do at least 40. There's it, no um, way. No. Depending on this Swalot set, this is a... This is, this is a... I, I'm gonna give you guys twenty more seconds. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna go plug my tweet real quick. Where's the twenty percent option? Uh, fourteen percent. Riff K. What else we got in here? Dell, can't you believe you weren't here to watch me? No, Ricky. Ricky, it's okay. I'll go watch your game after this. I had to step out and do a battle for a different league that I'm in, but um, it went well, so it it was worth it. I'll, I'll make for? it up to you, buddy. Did you play I, for PBA? I, I stepped out to play PBA. Yeah. Fuck, you didn't tell me about no, it. No, okay. no spoilers, no spoilers. No spoilers, no spoilers, no spoilers, no spoilers. Okay. I'm going to take more because there's lowest have, option. What is it? Is it special attack? Oh, let's look. I actually don't I know. This is my... Crocolord. Croc -croc 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 you got Crocolord. Uh, I will I will leave it at that. that there six... was a Crocolord on the other side of the field, and it may have actually worked very well for my opponent. So, um, All right, but let's see to... it. Let's see it. I've given enough time. We don't have a single boat above 40%. So you're all wrong if it does 50 or more. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it was 40. It was, that's about 40. Earthquake. That also did nothing. What even happened to this turn? So, fun fact, if that was not AV Swallow, that did 65 to 75. It actually nukes. Dude, and Specs Overheat, it doesn't see any drops on the Skeletor. You just force out a million slack offs. Yeah, you just keep spamming it. Not exactly what I would like to see, but... Still What's the, the ghost? I've never <laughs> seen in draft history, but it's funny. <laughs> hey man, hey man. Morgrem, my boy. Oh my god, he's definitely light clay. My boy. I think this dies. Oh my boy. I think this dies through light screen. No, he ate. We can't see. We can't see. Um, you can't see. Chat, chat says we can't see. No, no. Wait, wait, what? It said it was. Wait, it, it shows it in the background. Double? There was a double? Totally gonna get up both screens, I don't like that. But at least they don't have Where's the double? Maybe move the bingo to the left side. We can't see opponent's HP. Oh, oh opponent's HP. That's what it is. Oh, it's because of the layout. I got you, I got you, I got you. You move it around. Um, I'm gonna move it to bottom left for this battle. The layout. Oh, okay. Hold on. Close and pull. There was no double though. It's like a double has to be with intent. You can't just like both Pokemon switch 
and then it works out. I don't think he was calling the Morgrem with going into Palisade. If he was, we're having another poll on which authority we should draw or call. The Bingo Board's blocking. Okay, I got you. I got you. Oh yeah, you couldn't see how much it did. My bad. My bad. We'll go back. We'll go back. I got you guys. <laughs> Here it is. There you go. No. Big, big damage. Big damage. Skeletor's in a Morgrem was a double. Wait, okay, hold on. I'm not paying attention. I'm too busy tripping on this overheat spec Cinderace. Um, I guess I can go... Cinderace out here blocking out the haters. Yeah, Morgrem on the, on the sand is kind of kind of shy, Steve. Swaps out. Where are you going, Chief? Skeletor's. You know what, I'll take this. Okay. Skeletor. No, this isn't a double. He switched out into Morgrem because Skeledurge was scary. And he didn't switch out on the Swalot expecting the Dirge coming in. He just switched into it because it resisted the Earthquake, basically. <laughs> it doesn't resist the Earthquake, but it does. Oh, big poison. Huge! You can get a rock. Oh, wait, your Assault Vest. I suppose so. Nah, just, just Shadow Ball. Uh, oh. Okay, so it's living. Living at like 10%. This is actually going to do shit all to whatever comes in. Now that I think about it. Could be the Tatsugiri, actually. That's... Let's see. Like... Demon Tatsugiri. Wait, with the Nasty? He's going crazy. Wait, yeah, Nasty Tatsu go crazy. You know, one, one could... Can we also go back-to-back -back Morgan Love? No. To be fair, Sven makes a good point. He did switch twice. Okay. Yeah, I, will, I, will put it, I will put it on the board because we could have put in an earlier two for that. But next week, I'm going to put double parentheses with intent because I want it to be with intent, but I will put <laughs> it there. You are correct. I, I will give it to us. Here we go. I do like he has the items. Congratulations, on John Jr. on your six additional kills with Iron Law. You got more? Six? Okay. WPF also needs to have the police called on them. Nasty pots, I'm fucking in trouble. Wait, nasty, nasty Tatsu goes crazy. Tatsugiri is underappreciated. Wait, that is Call Mine Trailblaze Weakness Policy Vaporeon. Disgusting. I respect that. This is Demon. Show me nasty pot. You know you want it. Yeah. I feel like that's also the ugliest Tatsugiri color. You're not picking the pink one, you're crazy. What? That's Garfield. What do you mean? I want don't I don't want lasagna sushi. That's lasagna sushi. Lasagna the Tatsugiri. That's gross. Dude, Tatsugiri literally Garfield. Oh my god, this one's so bad. It lived! You got the spin! Wait, does he have speed weaver? No! Shard! He doesn't have shard! Oh god, why'd you live? You forsaken me, Weaver? Yo, Garfield, the freaking Tatsugiri's about to go in! Why is Life Orb Weavile the most regular set? That is a normal okay, but that is a normal set in general. I gotta agree with you, Septile. I do like the white one a lot. Come here for cum sushi. Yellow reminds me of the gummy one. Oh my goodness, give him one! There's no ice shard! This is so sad! That was a light screen up! He died! Spec Cinderace! Spec Cinderace! Spec Cinderace! Wait, if this is recover, is this a wrap? Does he just trailblaze here? Do anything. Do you see him or do you trailblaze here? Oh, big double. No, he's trying to bait the Draco, but like, if he recovers, is this over? Uh, why'd you miss? No, good. Oh! Good. oh. I'm recovering in the Vaporeon's <laughs> face, are you kidding me? Does he not have recover? What covers does this thing have? Your Draco, spin, nasty Draco, plot. Spin, nasty surf. Plot, surf. Oh, you can't yeah. fit you can't fit spin and recover. Can't fit spin and recover. I miss old broken. No, it gets recover. This one definitely gets recover. By the way, hold on. Tatsu? Yeah. Uh, 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 Why did I think it got recover? Yeah, I was gonna say I don't know I'm about tripping. that one. Owen. I'm, I'm big tripping. Oh, oh. my God! Mom. I'm big tripping. Rocks, get him up. Play game, rocks. Mid game his, rocks. His title for his other videos. Did I get railed by another goddamn dragonite? <laughs> <laughs> that, just, that just seems like you're yelling. It's that is title. amazing. <laughs> that's not a title. What do you mean? I don't think that's a title. <laughs> I would I would take off did and just say I get real by another goddamn dragon. <laughs> Owen be tripping. Owen tripping. A little bit. Is that D double you're with? That yeah, is D double back. I'm with. What's up, Kaiser? How's it going? I guess I can go you. 
the ED double. Wait, this is a dumb. This is see. I was like, oh, the Appleton's kind of normal too. He's Roselli for the thing. No, he's Leaf Storm. That's Demon. He's off. Leaf Storm probably nukes Valiant. Leaf Storm goes crazy. What came in? Dirge. Oh wait, dude, you're about to get. See, I'm done. Don't go into this guy. Go Vapo. I'd go Vapo. I'd 100% go Vapo. Love you, D double. Yo, thank you, Max. I appreciate the love you show in the videos, man. And yeah, it goes a long way. Appreciate you. Always appreciate the oh, this is always and the likes. Another good shit. Song. Oh my God, you're AV. That's AV Palace, and it took 30 from the not. This is gonna do. What? That's gonna put him at 40 next one, right? Ah, uh, no, he's he's swapping. Scream! Wait, no, oh, the Shadow Ball. Wait, 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 Dirge is weak to sh uh, unless that's just Terramon. Dirge is weak to to ghosts, and the Morgrim's is... dead. There's no ghost resist. I'm Jiggly Pigs in the BBR server. Yo, nice there's, man. There's I was no. To who that was. There's no resist to Shadow Ball. <laughs> this bitch got to it killed. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So this is Screamtail is. Oh. oh my god, it ate. Oh, I got off the rocks. rocks. Get, Get off the rock skis. <laughs> Get him up. I think Trick Room runs out here, right? Terra Valiant, so. so it's not Terra Dirge. Yeah, if it's not Terra, then Shadow Ball is super free there. Or to Power Kill. Yeah, you're fine. Psychic? Oh, bounce. Oh, eating. That did way more than I thought it was going to do, though, to be fair to AV Palisan from a weak ass Screamtail. Uh, I'm valiant. I've got a result. Want to be a daily coach next time? Nice. Oh, yeah, I forgot to join the BVR, sir. All right, let's get in there. Come get join. In we there. have a lot of fun, actually. It's actually very active in uh, oh, that our incubator chat, where oh. like sometimes some coaches will pop in and chat down there, and just lots of good people in the server. Like, it's been really growing, and everybody in the stream right now is a big reason for that. So, who trust grass? Yes, everybody here. And we're we're CM Trailblaze. Into unaware dirge. Yep. That's a Gary. That's actually perfect. Wait, now you now you Trailblaze up. Trailblaze up. So we fast as hell. Trailblaze up. I don't know if we sweep. Does it not? Uh, does it not speed, fella? Played. Yes. The video will be going up on Sunday, Max. Tune in. The grand return of Mr. All of them. Go up on Sunday. Specifically, go watch my video though um, before you watch Joey's. Um, <laughs> he said you watch both. Watch mine first. <laughs> Big boost in following when AM shouts me out, dude. I, 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 I've been telling a lot of my buddies this, and and oh, Owen's a big reason why I'm in like the draft community as it is right now. Oh no, he ate. But um, I could I could like upload videos to ten people and I'd be happy. It's it's just such a it's it's really nice like the amount of support I've been getting for it but it, like I, you don't do it for stuff you do it because you have fun editing and making thumbnails and like all that kind of shit. I don't. That's, that's the best. Part. I think it should be in the description right here, Iris, if you want to join. Um, if not, somebody else drop it in the chat for. Oh here. Um. Since you oh, so invite, thanks, Fran. Yo, shut up, Appreciate Randy. You. Oh no, it outsped. Wait, 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 wait. Was it Booster? Hold on, I didn't even see. I'm gonna make sure I check for it. It's booster. Yes, it's booster speed. speed. Uh, feels bad. No, I don't think it Oko Dirge though. So Dirge probably could have came in too. But yeah, this thing wins. <laughs> no, the heat was too much. We just had a little bit too much of it. Just a little too much. Could be a celebrity, whether I like it or not. I'm okay with that. I could be a niche micro celebrity in the Pokemon community. Does that mean everything dies? No. Telling the boys, we only. I no, everything does not die. I think you go. You go Appleton. You drop a Leaf Storm. You go Appleton, you drop a Leaf Storm, you either kill this or chip the Dirge coming in, then you sack off... Oh, you go Hard Cinderace and sack it? No, you have to go Bronzong? I don't know. This is a, this is a tough position, because you have to go Apple here. Do you double calling the Dirge? If you double Cinderace, actually, I think double Cinderace um, calling the Dirge coming in um, might be your play, because you double, you catch it, you get off a Spec Shadow... <laughs> Fuck, man. You have um, a Spec Shadow Ball, and you either do a ton to the Dirge... Oh, but... Then your Appleton loses. I think Dirge wins. Pickles, I use uh, Adobe Photoshop and Premiere, but there are some free recording websites and things like that that you can use to like record mm -hmm. your showdown videos and, we... and things like that. And um, thumbnails you can make for free on Canva. Uh, highly recommend. 
if yeah. you're getting into things and doing new stuff. Oh, um, very good free Terra website Steel. to use. Shit, it's Terra Steel. Oh shit. <laughs> I oh, didn't even know it got that. That's hella funny. Okay, yeah, then this does one just immediately. That's a lot though. Okay, Jesus. Chip. Uh, For Apple. Goodbye, Mr. Pie. Did you know I thought that stepped on stepped outside? I thought you said that. I thought you were dropping a bomb if they were the same people. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? I know both those guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the same game. <laughs> Dude, uh, Sceptile, God tier anime Pokemon. Personal layouts and yeah, I um, yeah. I definitely would recommend though if you want to play in something like D League next season, get a little bit of resume going, upload whatever showdown leagues you're in, and um, things like that. Maybe get into a Wi-Fi league and get a little bit of a portfolio because. Um, provided Wi-Fi keeps growing, it obviously isn't going to be the easiest thing to get into any single Wi-Fi league, so building up your own resume is a good, good idea. Mm-hmm. If you tear a steel, you're going to die. Oh, yeah, we... Yeah, we probably shouldn't have teared. Stuck on a goddamn Chromebook? Dude, Pickles, when I first started, I was making Showdown stuff on a Chromebook, so you can 100% make Showdown videos <laughs> on a Chromebook. Absolutely. You just have to recognize, like, what you can make videos on, yeah. So, so much fun. I had, I had a blast. And, and you won't, like... If you're making videos to like try to get big, it's not gonna happen. But if you're making videos because you just want to have fun and make like funny videos and edit memes into them, then yeah. draft, absolutely you have a blast draft isn't it. draft isn't the thing to get into for making videos for become a big time YouTuber. Yo, Septile, that's actually smart. That's a good free one too for layouts and stuff. Um, who else haven't we watched? We haven't watched Brody versus Odds or Brody versus Ant. Brody versus Odds. <laughs> yeah, that happens sometimes. No um, Gen Nine resume, dude. Get into it, Franny. Well, that's... Feel free to pop in. What if I just battle you, Giovanna, if I win, I'm in? That, that is not exactly how <laughs> Dude, it works. The LeChonk, the LeChonk versus the Smoke on... Um, oh, yeah, the, 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 the Finch game. game. Yeah, the Finch game. <laughs> I want to do shout out movies. I think those are fun to watch. Absolutely, Iris. Those are blast. Uh, those are my favorite videos to make. Um, I don't have any shirt on League's Ending right now, so i got to wait a little bit for my next one. But I have one I where have I have Trode as the kill leader. I can't wait to put just do Electrode's big-ass face on it. Um, make a thumbnail out of it. Um, Pickles, let me see if I can find the old website I used to use to record. Oh, just a good one. I'm probably confident. I appreciate it. Um, if you make it big in draft league, you earn one dollar, dude. I have to, dude. <laughs> facts. I'm making big time YouTube bucks. Got monetized. Oh my gosh, I don't even work a real job anymore. I lied about going to work in an hour. Um, who haven't we watched yet? I think we watched everybody besides Brody and Ant. Right. Okay. What's so, right? Mr. Pickles in the chat, or Mrs. Pickles, or non-conforming uh, adjective. Um, you can download screen recorder for Google Chrome specifically off of the store and it'll let you record your entire screen, your microphone and your system all at once. So, um, 10 out of 10 recommend Mm -hmm. just screen recorder and it's on the Google Chrome store and it's free. Mm -hmm. Um, so very good, very good to use it. And then it doesn't have to be crazy high quality to jump in. Yeah. Yeah. You can just have a goofy little like. $5 $5 mic that you find somewhere. I know Walmart has like $10, $15 ones that you can get. And just like, if you just want to talk into a screen, so much fun. I feel like I've won a couple money leagues, yeah. <laughs> and um, what do you call it? I, uh, big uh, sword and, or scarlet and violet drop time. I actually made a decent, I paid for my Christmas presents with my YouTube money because the videos were popping then. Um, here is... Brody's video. Go drop him a like. Drop him a sub. Oh, he's down to a hundred. We can't let him drop below hundred. We have to give him a couple so he has that uh that cushion. Yeah. Such viewers. Look at him. And then Ant. These are two of my very close friends. Um, so I would appreciate it if you want to uh, check them out. I'll join server. Good stuff. All right. You can check both of them out. Appreciate it. Um, and we can kind of jump into it. So we see more Terra Pow. Look at that. Terra Pow and Terra D Knight. We we start with Terra Pow, Terra D Knight, and end with it. Um. I, I kind of know what happens in this game in general, so we're just going to kind of let it ride. It's kind of why this is the last one that we watch, because I watched this game when they played it live and call. So I 100% know what happens in this one, but we'll click on it. If you guys haven't too, by the way, if you want to drop a like on the stream, I'd appreciate it a ton. If you're new, just checking out from the VBR server, if you want to drop me a sub, I'd appreciate it as well. Okay. Blow up Owen. Owen to 2K. Owen to 2K. There's literally enough people to get me 300 subs right now in the chat. Crazy. <laughs> Um, we see Earth Power Turn 1. He was Air Balloon on this, by the way. I think I might have skipped past that already. Um, and Brody just selected to um, Dragon Tail it out, pop the balloon, um, get a little bit of momentum. As he Dragon Tails again as the D-Knight comes out. Obviously to prevent any kind of setup, Zong comes out, Dragon Tail. Right? 
Get down to the D night. Oh, look at Brody, all the cuts too, all the edits. This is crisp. We're going fast right now. Dude, is it, I can't even keep up at two times speed. Oh my god, it's only 13 minutes. Look at this. <laughs> 20 likes. I appreciate y'all. Thank you. Um, as he details and misses. Um, now this is a play I talked with Brody about right here. And you're gonna see, I think this would really help them out right now. Getting up these early game rocks would have been huge um, at this point. If Dragon's tailing out, he's gonna get up his rocks regardless or get off a hit anyways. You might as well get up your rocks and then like maybe fire blast the turn afterwards because you don't really have many opportunities if something faster and offensive comes in against you and just kills you. You know what I mean? So I think that Brody probably should have rocks here and it's the thing with Brody in general where he doesn't really value hazards <laughs> as highly as he should, um, especially with how little that does. And Ice Spinner's going to pop. And I think... Yep, I was going to say, I think Brody did not know that it got Ice Spinner going into this, which is pretty funny as well. Um, So it goes down. He gets into POW. This is another one right here. You see him, he clicked Crunch right here. Now, the reason he's Terra Electric is there's an Azumar on the back. From this position, <clears throat> this thing dies. Guarantee. He showed Super Spadef with that Fire Blast. Not, not Heat Proof, but Super Spadef with that Fire Blast. This is like the freest Terra Electric of Brody's life. You tear electric, you uh, get off that tear blast, and you, you know, lose your really bad defensive typing in this game, plus lose that rock weakness if he gets up rocks later on or something like that. So I think we probably should have tear electric right here um, and tear blasted. He should just sack Ronzong, but it also covers that choke of him going out into the Azumarill and just getting blown up because Azumarill can probably live a crunch into a tear blast electric. Uh, but it's going to come out right here, which definitely makes sense. It gets, oh, it, it spins, but it doesn't get rapid spin for some reason. Uh, Player of Pops does absolutely nothing to this Pokemon. I'm pretty sure Ant was pretty darn fizz deaf, as you usually are. Um, still huge power, but pretty fizz deaf into this. I thought it was a leg spin. As long as you spin and... We spinning. Spin again. If everyone thought makes an SV, it should get spinner. I'm sure. Don't know how any spin works. Mm -hmm. I, I just want it to be rapid spin. I just want... Uh, oh, dude, I, another thing. I really, really like the, the idle animation of Grinchon. He's just kind of sitting there vibing, um, closing his eyes. He's there for a good time. And he gets down and fucking ready to go. Big Future Sight by Brody. And Future Sight is really, really tough for Ant to guard against. Future Sight plus, like, POW. And Future Sight plus, like, um... What do you call it? Um, what, else is it what else does he have right here? Oh, Slither. That's what I was thinking. That plus Slither is really, really nice him for sure hold on let's get back into here oh we went too far here we go okay cool so if you just sight in the air um ant i believe was like an extra belt mix set um and i think he clicks hard gunk shot right here which is pretty uh pretty ballsy call into brody's scarf sylvia now i don't think he outsped ants gren um, but it's a really really clutch um you know call and able to pick him off i don't think it outsped gren though um and that's a, that's a pretty demon brain. It's a pretty demon brain. <laughs> Let me know if we get anything else, too, on the bingo board. We never got one turn one KO. We haven't gotten any benches, three plus heavy duty boots. Nothing like that. But Crash yeah. is pretty free right here. I mean, Terra Blast is also super free here. Terra Blast is also super free. I guess, like, if Crash has a chance to KO and Terra Blast doesn't, I don't know. But he also just has to switch out in general, because Terra Dark Crunch blows him up, too. Um, he misses that Crash, but it's fine, because that plus Future Sight also killed something. Which is another big thing, too. So, like, if he could... I guess Crash into Future Sight into Terra Blast also killed the Zoomerill, so he didn't really need to Terra there, to be completely honest. So, that's fine. He's killed if Gren. So true. Um, but, yeah, from here... I think Brody actually makes a really good play, and he Terra's. <laughs> yeah, and, and he says getting rid of my weakness because one, this covers like a like a weird scarf ring, um, which I don't think comes, but uh, it also covers vacuum wave, which is really cool as well. Like uh, it covers vacuum wave, which is really awesome, um, because he might have gotten blown up by like a life or vacuum wave um, if he stayed dark and ice, uh, which Ant wasn't, but smart smart idea from Brody because he said it out loud like that was what he was specifically calling, so definitely smart. We see Azu come out, um, and this is the power of Terra Electric Chin Pow. Like, this thing, ugh, it just forced a KO. Like, I, I don't know, it's so tough to deal with this thing. I really do think that it's bannable. The more and more I see it used every single week, game in and game out, I just, I, it is just too much. <laughs> it is too damn much. Um, there's a click right here. <clears throat> yeah. 
breakthrough team with us. Blam. Good night, Azumarill. Um, it is Wakan. It still does 50. Um, as he draws a play rough and gets an attack drop, actually. It didn't show it there because Brody cut it. Um, but it got an attack drop, and it's still going to blow up this thing with another Terra Electric, okay. which is crazy. Turn 1 KO? No, the, the grand play wasn't turn 1. Turn 1 was Sandy Shocks versus Garchomp. And it Dragon Tailed on an Earth Power. I hate Shen Pao. I think everybody hates Shen Pao. That was also a crit. It has serviceable physical bulk too, is the crazy thing. That was play rough into Aqua Jet crit, not killing it from an Azumarill. So, uh, that is over with. Specifically with Terra, Ter or especially with Terra. Yeah, I, I think I think just about everyone does. Um, so that's, that is fair. That is fair. Um, and what? I know that. I think Ant actually was not... So this is a big play. Ant wasn't Terra normal E-Speed. He was actually a Terra flying special set in a Brody's team. Uh, when you play things like the Slowbro and Bronzong and things like that. Or not Bronzong. What else was there? Ant had Bronzong. Um, things like Slowbro, Corviknight. Sorry. Um, special did much, much better. I believe he was Agility, Terra flying Hurricane, Ice Beam, and Thunderbolt. And if Ant's game plan went correctly, it was to get up a bunch of Hazards with this guy um and you know obviously being a hazard that beats his defogger getting up a bunch of hazards and chipping things down to range of that agility d knight so um that's pretty tough you beat it with tinkaton tinkaton does kind of beat chin pow but not really because it gets like fucking three a kill by band crunch um but yeah i had to feel uh hardy for um hardy for his opponent when they got a d knight i mean <laughs> d knight is pretty broken uh, but I think Pow is more broken. In this format specifically. I think if it was free Terra, D Knight would be more broken for sure. Um, but yeah. Flinch, and that it seals the game. And that's game! Yeah, and then you just Terra Blast for the, so the no miss move. Hard to feel sorry for CP's mm -hmm. opponent when they got a D Knight. Yeah, <laughs> it's tough. D Knight is a Pokemon of all time. Flinch is a good being oh, board option. You, you're saying that like D Knight isn't crazy. <laughs> D Knight is pretty tough. I do. I think that's loose to ban Sigurdsson, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I do object, I, I said this a second ago, I do objectively think that in this format, specifically not free Terra, where you just get to pick a couple times, I think Chin Power is way more broken than D-Knight. Um, but I do think free Terra D-Knight is like by far the most Pokemon in draft. Like, that mod's crazy. And Saint Shocks, and it dies. Big Chin Pow. And in true Brody fashion, he's just missing words in his title. And he has a bunch of things. There's no is or Chin Pao is the or is Chin Pao the most broken. Is Chin Pao most broken Terra Pokemon in singles? 87 exclamation. I sent that message before Flinch. That's very true. Um, but yeah, shout outs to Brody for making that last video really quick. Because I've been streaming for like two hours and uh, two and a half hours. And I need to do the dishes before work. So um, I think that's where we're going to end it for the day. Again, if you guys enjoyed, I'd appreciate if you dropped a like. And if you haven't subbed to the channel, I'd appreciate that as well. Um, we'll be live again next week with the same thing. Um, I'll post the dis or the, the bingo board in the server too if you guys want to look in the incubator chat. Join the Discord. Um, sub to all the D-League coaches and obviously stick around.